Hey guys, Fia back at it again with another Twitch VOD. This one is from the 6th of April, 2022, and we did a Dark Moon Fair stream, which is really kind of out of left field, but we had a stream challenge, unlocked it using people's channels points over on Twitch, and uh, yeah, it was actually really fun. I managed to get a lot of stuff done that I didn't think I would, and, uh, and that's really nice. Anyway, enjoy. If you'd like to catch us live, you can do so at twitch.tv forward slash Fiyama. If you add on a slash schedule to the end of that, uh, you'll get all of my streams converted to your time zone, like when I'll be going live next and stuff, which would be fantastic because then you know when to be there. And if you're feeling super generous today, I would really love a follow over on my Instagram. I'm really trying to build my followers over there so that I can perhaps score some brand deals in the future. But if you're feeling generous, that's where to go. Down in the description box is also links for or Twitter, Facebook, and TikTok, if you prefer any of those platforms. But I hope you enjoy the VOD, and fingers crossed, we'll see you in chat next time. Hello. Welcome back. I hope everyone is doing wonderfully well today. Uh, it's Dark Moon Fair Day, but first, but first, we begin our battle. Uh, all right, so I can reduce one. Okay, that finally posted. God, I was having a bit of an issue with Twitter today. It's a little bit funky, but that's okay. Uh, place your units, follow that link in chat, log in with your Twitch account, and drag and drop those units to the battlefield, please and thank you. Oh, excuse me. I've been having a time. Uh, Zam was here early, finished watching the last stream, and I'm ready for the new one. I on I wish we still got stats on how many people actually watched the VODs. Because, like, I mean, you know, not many people are, are using Twitch as a VOD platform, but they are super handy to, like, catch up on streams you've missed or, or anything like that. But, like, I'm so glad that they're there for, you know, it's, it's nice. It's nice. And I'm, I'm work, I'm making progress on the the vods being uploaded to youtube as well i'm doing pretty well i'm i'm on track which i'm really happy about um i'm still uh halfway through heartbreak of odds so it's gonna be a while before they all get uploaded but that's okay that's okay uh so the first thing first thing is first there's a new game here somewhere I've actually not done the, um, I've not done the what's it either, because this is, this is how long it's been since I've been to Dark Moon. I haven't done the roller coaster, and I haven't done the dancing game, and the dancing game has achievements. There are achievements. Is this, what is this? Dance master, good. All right, well done, Zam on first. Shiba with second. Yori with last, and of course the sound commands. Welcome on in. You're here today is most lovely. Oh, thank you. I appreciate that. I've had it like t I I accidentally fell asleep with it in a ponytail, and then I've had it in like a like what the hell, just get it out of my face sort of bun all day, and then I took it out and I put some dry shampoo in it because it was a little bit greasy around the front. And sort of, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> it needs a wash tonight. But thank you very much. I appreciate that. Making progress and we're noticing it. I'm so pleased, Sam. So pleased. Hey, Silva. Morning to all fellow Scandinavians. Afternoon to you, Dabba Aussies. Hello, Silva. Welcome on in. I hope you're having a fantastic day. All right. Dancing time. You need something? Dance, dance, dark moon. Simon says, are you ready to dance? Step on in and show off your sweet moves, mage. The rules are simple. Your opponent will perform a series of stylish moves. Then you gotta match them. Earn enough accolades and come back to old Simon. Just know the more challenging the opponent, the more accolades you can earn. Simon says, are you up for the challenge? Interesting. Okay. So it's not like a, they haven't managed to incorporate DDR into WoW. Hello. It's, it's, a, it's a make the pattern. All right. 
Copy the Dance Master's moves and it's your turn, you'll earn points with the audience. If you get the crowd going, build up a score multiplier, score high enough, you'll earn yourself some prize tickets. Brilliant. Do I have any tokens? No. Good. I probably have them in my bank, but let's go get some anyway. Are they? They're from the guy, the person at the top, right? So what is up? What's happening? How is everyone? How are you all today? <clears throat> Let's get a sack of tokens. I feel like I'm going to need that. Uh, I do have 18 in my bank. Good. That's right. Actually, I can probably... I'll be right for now. Too long to this morning. I feel like shit still. Oof. The Oralid Mount, because be my luck, I can do that. I can do that. Done. Really good, been on a roll lately with life. Oh, that's so good to hear. That's awesome. What can I do for you? Okay, ready to dance. Now, that, okay, so there's three difficulties and there are achievements for each difficulty. So we're going to go with just something fun and easygoing to start. Let's warm up. Oh, this is funky. Oh, so it is kind of, okay. Chicken, power spin, and fist pump. It's blue, pink, yellow. Pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue. Pink, yellow, pink. Pink, yellow, pink. One moment, Shiba, I did see your question. Blue, pink, blue. Blue, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, pink. Oh, look at that. Max score. Legendary. Achievements. Yay. Fantastic. That's really cute. I like it a lot. What colors are on your face? Your camera likes to mess around with blues and greens. It does. And uh, yeah, it, it messes around with um with yellow. Yellow, it, it can't do yellow. It just, it can't figure yellow out, which is what I'm wearing today, kind of. So um, I have the, the color on my lid, like closest to my nose, is like a blue green sort of shade. It's It's very pretty and shimmery, but it's not showing up very well on camera because it can't get sparkle properly. So it's like a blue green sort of shade. The the outer corner is very much like an old gold. So old gold, think about gold plated stuff that's gotten tarnished or something like that. So it's it's darker, a little bit more gray, dustier, that kind of thing. And then in my crease that you can totally not see on camera, I've got a mustard yellow, like mustard yellow, um, but just a little bit of that. I put on I put on the shiny stuff and then I just did kind of like a halo of, of mustard yellow around it, just like a really light little bit. Um, yes. I own it. It's a ground mount. Have fun. Good as always. Thank you, Josh. I hope you're doing well today. Thank you, Zim, for your contribution. To the stream challenge, community points, embers, yes. Look at all the hydrates, X. Brilliant. Hello, how are you? Blue gold armored war steed. <laughs> no. I don't, is that actually... I'm confused. That's fine. No, it's it's not, it's not the, not the armored war steed. Okay, so never been used. Huh? Oh, I'm doing right, thanks. How are you? Yeah, I'm doing 
doing all right. I actually have a killer headache, uh, which has been hovering around for a couple of hours and I was hoping it would fade before stream. But so right before I turned the camera on, um, I took a couple of Nurofen. So I'm hoping that it will settle the hell down soon because it hurts. Because <laughs> it hurts. Um, all right, let's shift click this to refresh it because it's not noting that I've done those achievements now. There we go. Updated! The hydrates will hopefully help with the headache as well. I'm off but good. Hope you're well. Tony Windrider! No. But thank you very much for the lurk, X. We'll see you soon. Enjoy. Gilded Ravisaur? No. Googled Blue Gold Wow Mount and that came up. Then I saw the note saying this is an unused look! <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. Good afternoon, Traz. Welcome back. How are you? Arboreal Gulper. No. Alright, let's do another. Oh, accolades earned 20%. Alright, um, let's do so the first achievement that I'm gonna aim for is earn a perfect score in the Dark Moon Fair Dance game on the easiest difficulty. 10 times. So we've done one. How so we need to do another nine. Safe travel. But it's easy. It's like three. Seriously. It'll be fine. Okay, Lolo, enjoy your lurk, Yuri. May the light bless your moves. I like that. This is fun. I'm enjoying this. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Blue. Yellow. Pink. I do like that they're different shapes as well for like colorblind folk. Blue, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, pink. Yellow, blue, pink. Yellow, blue, pink. Pink, yellow, blue. Pink, yellow, blue. Legendary. Yellow, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue. Smashed it. Oh, look at all the flowers. That's cute. That's cute. Fingers crossed. Today's are off. We usually get them from pain in my neck or lack of caffeine. <sighs> yeah, I, it could be any number of things when it comes to my body. My body is shit. Um, <laughs> but yeah, there's, there's a few things I think it might be, but I've been trying to, um, I've been trying to fix those and it doesn't seem to be helping. I'm, I'm at the point now where I'm pretty much getting a headache every day, uh, which is not great. Like in the morning I'll be fine, but then by like mid afternoon, I have a killer headache every day without fail so yeah it's um i'll see how i go let's see how i go uh swift green hawk strider no thank you rel for the contribution to the stream challenge remember we've got to get to 50 percent today to stay on track Thank you, Draz, for your contribution also. Alrighty. Easy mode again. See you later. I like achievements. There's quite a few here to get to. And a toy! Pink. Yellow. Pink. Pink. Yellow. Pink. There's an add-on to do this by now, isn't there? Like, click things as they happen and have, like, the list on the screen or whatever. Yellow. Pink. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Blue. <clears throat> Yellow, pink, blue. <clears throat> 
Blue. Yellow. Pink. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Blue. Pink. Yellow. Blue. Pink. Yellow. See you guys and social from the rooftops yet. Figured I'd start the ball rolling passively. Love it. Wonderful, Rel. And thank you very much, Meaty, for your contribution to the stream challenge. Have you guys actually gone and checked out the game that Jess and I will be playing if it's successful? Just out of curiosity. You need something? Apathy as well. Ooh, and more hydrates. All right. Look, I'm getting there. In bed feeling like I'm dying from the COVID's need a distraction. Oh, matey. Well, I'm doing Dance Dance Dark Moon. It's fun. I'm enjoying this. I mean, I'm still on easy mode only, but like, I'm trying to. There's an achievement for doing 10 easy mode. Yep. Uh, just adding some to the bed. Uh, I wanted to double push heels at me. She's scary. She's throwing a picture. <laughs> hey, a nurse. How are you going? Oh, it's just me. I must have swallowed some air while I was drinking. Blue. Pink. Yellow. Blue. Pink. Yellow. Pink. Yellow. Blue. Pink, yellow, blue. Yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue. Blue, yellow, blue. Ah, uh, it looks cool. It is a really cool looking game. Swift Blue Raptor, no. It's like to stay on her good side too. I've not done the achievements for this. I know I've done some rock band and a cave things in the bus. Yeah, I need to do some of those today. I'm missing so many of those because it's just so goddamn difficult. Like, it's actually really tricky. Um, How are you? There are some that you require, like, other people there for and stuff. Like, ugh. Have a good one. Oh, thanks to having you puppy for company. I'm too exhausted to move. Agreed. Absolutely. <laughs> That's cute. Pink. Blue. Pink. Pink, blue, pink. I love that it's like Bay versus Brittany. Like, yeah, it's great. Pink, blue, pink. Pink, blue, pink. Good morning, Floor. How you going? Welcome on in. Yellow, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. God, the chicken dance looks ridiculous. Blue, pink, yellow. Blue, pink, yellow. I think it's because I keep smacking myself in the head with my shoulders. I think that's what makes it look the most ridiculous. that yellow is the chicken dance. Is this DMF? Never saw that. Yeah, no, it's, um, look, it's not super, it's not super new. I'm just behind. Um, but it is a relatively new, uh, mini game that they've, a relatively new daily that they've added. Um, so there's like three difficulties, easy, medium, and hard. 
uh, and there are achievements for doing perfect score on easy 10 times, medium 10 times, and hard 10 times. Uh, so I'm knocking out those achievements, just crossing them all off the list real quick. Real quick. Safe travel. <clears throat> All right. What can I do for you? More easy stuff because we get up to ten. And they run around to fish, of course, of course. Yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue. Pink, blue, pink. Pink, blue, pink. Pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, yellow. I do know sleeping is his favorite pastime. Fantastic. Okay. See you around. I'm getting there. This is my seventh round of easy, so we're almost there. Pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Blue. Yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, pink. Yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, yellow. It's very cute. I quite like this. I'm guessing it's going to add a fourth color and then a fifth color as it goes to medium and hey hard. That makes the most sense to me. See you later. Pink, yellow, blue. Pink, yellow, blue. Pink, yellow, blue. Pink, yellow, blue. Yellow, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, yellow. Yes, the Apex of Shard Dailies, yeah. A little cuter though. Pink, yellow, pink. Pink, yellow, pink. It was like they lit up and you had to like click them in the right order, yeah? God, that was a while ago. Whew, wow. Time hath passed. <laughs> 
Oh dear. I'm getting annoyed by these things, so I'm gonna quickly just do this. There we go. Alright. Easy mode. We only got what? Two more? Two more rounds of easy mode to go. Because they're made of hide. <laughs> I like that. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Blue, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, blue. Blue, yellow, blue. Has everyone else got these achievements done? Or are you heading there now to do them with me? Pink, yellow, pink. Pink, yellow, pink. Pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow. Afternoon, Trud. How are you doing today? How are you? See you later. We go. This should be our last round of easy, and I should get the achieve. We can step up to medium. Oh, that's a new person. Yellow, blue, pink. Yellow, blue, pink. Yeah, I'm not doing too badly. Bit of a headache though, so I've taken some painkillers. I'll get there. Pink, yellow, pink. Pink, yellow, pink. Blue, 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 yellow, pink. Ah, uh, brain is slow today. I only just got the road to kill all the pain. Indeed, indeed. There you go. Feeling it. Achievement completed. Achievement completed. I have to refresh this though because it doesn't seem to be updating them properly. There we go. It has crossed off the list. So we're going to step up to medium. I'm guessing we're going to have four colors. Green? Oh, nope, still only three. Maybe it'll do three or four ones though, rather than. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Yeah. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. And it also moves faster. Pink, yellow, pink, yellow. Pink, yellow, pink, yellow. Ah, uh, yeah, Nurofen. Yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Oh, and I think I have to get more score as well, by the looks of it. Yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Yellow, blue, yellow, blue. I think one more round. Blue, pink, yellow, blue. Blue, pink, yellow, blue. I enjoy your lurk, fairy. Thanks for hanging out. Cool, yeah. That's alright. 
If it's, uh, if it still hasn't moved its butt out of my head in an hour or so. I do have some stronger things, but I try to avoid taking them unless I actually have to. Because, like, otherwise they become less effective over time. Like, if you have them too often, like, if you have panadine and stuff like that too often, then, yeah, you, your body gains a resistance to coding. And, uh then it doesn't work anymore and then you need more powerful painkillers and then they're addictive and then it's just it's not it's not good for you um so yeah i i start from the bottom take that if that doesn't work then i step it up but i try not to uh can you hit the sequence as quick as you like y yes and no so um i'm not sure if you can see on like I'm not sure if you can see I'm, I'm assuming because you're lying down you might be a bit far away from the screen and so you or you you like or maybe it's the baby screen or whatever um there is the the GCD on it so you can't once you push one you can't push anything else for like a second or so um but as soon as the GCD is up you can hit the next one Good day to you. if that makes sense Safe travel. so you can't just like type it in but you can like you can hit them pretty speedily <laughs> Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. We'll do the battle after this round. Yeah, so just timing it to GCD, yeah. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. So pink, yellow, blue, yellow. That's pretty much as quick as I could hit them. Blue, yellow, pink. Blue. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, pink, blue, yellow. Blue, pink, blue, yellow. One more. Yellow, pink, yellow, blue. Yellow, pink, yellow, blue. Ta-da! I remember the days. You get Mercendol without a script. That stuff was potent. I don't know what Mercendol is. Uh, what's about makeup today? No one has guessed it yet. I see it now. Oh, okay, awesome. Yeah. Hey there. Um, did I? I think I've done what a feeling. Yeah, that's done. I'm two. Two out of ten for can't stop the feeling. And don't stop dancing is the 30. So if you do the 10 of each difficulty, you get the 30 as well. And the 10 of each difficulty will get you the meta, which gives you the toy. So yeah, Hello. nice and easy. Safe travel. <laughs> mm, is it Albino Drake? It is not. Ah, uh, Funky. The name is Funky. Yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, pink, blue, yellow. Blue, pink, blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Uh, okay, looks like a powerful muscle relaxant. Yeah, that's probably why it's not over the counter anymore. It'd be abuse to shit. Yeah, unfortunately, just because something works really, really well, um, doesn't mean it's the best thing to be. <laughs> putting into your body um 
and all this, especially with medical stuff, the research is updating all the time. And so, so like, God, look at stuff like, um, oh, what was it called? The morning sickness drug. Uh, what was it called? Thalidomide. Thalidomide. Heavily, 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 heavily prescribed for morning sickness because it fucking worked. It did the job. Women were able to, you know, go about their business while they were pregnant and, and you know, pop a pill and, and no more morning sickness. Hey, presto. And then they had their babies and they didn't have limbs. Or the babies died before they were born and, and all of this kind of stuff. Like, it was horrendous and horrible. <laughs> so much stuff, like, we just don't know what it is actually doing until sometimes it's too late. Because you need those examples of it actually happening to know that that's what it can do. Yeah. Ah, oh, dear. Humanity. Isn't it great? Um, Blue Mechanistrider, no. Do it once, feel like I'm aware from anesthesia. Oof, gross. Uh, anything with coding and the mechanics, people abusing it. Yep, absolutely. Yeah, no, that one, like the one. Yep, thalidomide. Bronze Drake, no. Captured Swamp Stalker, no. No one knows what stock companies ever saying something is safe for pregnant women, which makes it also quite hard. Yep. Yep. Yeah, dying is not cool. Yeah, no, agreed. Dying dying is not cool. <laughs> yeah, uh... Like, a lot of the medication I've taken over the years in the, the pamphlets, um, there was one particular one that I wasn't allowed to have. Like, I was not allowed to be prescribed it until I confirmed that I was on birth control. Um, because it just, it totally and utterly completely fucks up babies. Like, it just, like if you were pregnant, and you were on this medication? Nope. Like it just, yeah, it won't, it won't kill them, but it will, it will do a hell of a lot of damage. Um, so I had to actually like make like a formal statement that I was on birth control and all this kind of stuff to be able to get the script. Um, and uh, a lot of the other ones that I have, you know how you get the, the the pamphlets with all the like side effects and what not to take and what like what not to take with it and stuff and all that kind of fun stuff. Um, they've always got a section like you know medication and pregnancy, and most of mine say there is not there have not been any studies conducted around the way that this medication interacts with pregnancy. Like they just don't know because it's not safe to run those trials anymore either. So all they can say is we don't know. We don't know. <clears throat> and Sorcel Leverworm, no. Brian Deep Bottom Feeder, no. Bruce, no. Gilded Ravisaur, no. Goblin Trike, no. Emerald Raptor, no. At least I can run through these pretty quickly. Uh, for a few of my mental health meds like that, one has such a long half-life you need to be off at 12 months before becoming pregnant. Yeah, I've, um... There are, there are some stuff that I'm on for the autoimmune things that, well, you can imagine, you know, if it messes with your immune system, it's, <laughs> it's probably going to mess with anything and everything else inside of your body, right? Um, I don't think it's a 12 month half-life that I have, the one that I, but it is, it's like, I think it's like six months or something like that. So that's fun. Um, or it might've been one I was on previously. Look, I've kind of lost track. All I know is no one baby. Like, no one, baby. Um, it's it's pretty easy, pretty easy to remember. <laughs> Have to do the dinner thingy, might be on a bit later, might not, depends on the life of the Extra, not a worry, Rel, enjoy your food. I hope it's delicious. Swift, green, wind rider, no. Mr. Moo, thank you for your contribution. Much appreciated. See you later. Much appreciated. Enjoy your lurk, Rel. Blue, 
yellow, blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Pink, yellow, blue, pink. Pink, yellow, blue, pink. Bit true, Stone Drake. No. Stop worrying after you strike to me. Some of my fur babies. Totally fair. Pink, blue, yellow, blue. Pink. Where they go? Pink, blue, yellow, blue. Turquoise Raptor. No. Blue, pink, blue, pink. Blue, pink, blue, pink. So I need to peel the time down on one one immediately. Yep. Yep. Yellow, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, pink, blue, pink. Yeah, some some medications have these these weird side effects that are like in any day life would be like totally innocuous innocu like like oh maybe I've been drinking too much water or something but it can be like a life-threatening sign of near death like it's just, it's so weird right I mean obviously medications affect our bodies because that's what they're designed to do med effect um, they're, they're designed to affect the body in a positive direction so like removing pain or making your brain absorb happy chemicals properly or whatever like obviously that's a very like simplified you know but anyway um but they alter like because they alter the body in that way guarantee you they alter the body in other ways as well like it's just it's a thing yeah that's not worrying at all well that's the thing though like when when a doctor says something like that like that that kind of go you go oh that's a bit scary at least then the doctor knows that you'll actually take it seriously because they've frightened you enough. Like, sometimes it's needed, you know? Ah, <sighs> Tamed Mola, no. Okay, got the hella nervous. Like, like, logging your pee. Uh, like, after, <laughs> like, damn, did I pee? Did I pee lots? Did I pee just a little bit? Like, yep. All the time. Scary it all. Ajari Bloat Rain, no. You got a Buckle Buck component. Nice. Well done. Battlebound Warhound, no. What's oh, the Herb Trader tomorrow? Yeah. See you around. And again, this will be number five. This will be halfway there for the medium ones, which means halfway to the achievement as well. Like the big one, the meta. Pink, blue, yellow, blue. Pink, blue, yellow, blue. Spawn of Horridon, no. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, pink, blue, pink. Blue Drake, no. Pink, yellow, blue, pink. Pink, yellow, blue, pink. Ah, it is not the sea turtle. Pink, blue, pink, yellow. Pink, blue, pink, yellow. Legendary. Perfect score. Heavy medicine, get deployed. The right places, entire research field. I was also feeling need to explain the interaction between two or more drugs. Don't remember when it became a thing, but it's surprisingly recent. Yeah. Yeah, like different chemicals, when you take them at the same time, can react like they do in a test tube. Funnily enough. Yeah, it's, uh... Oh, it's amazing how, like, how advanced we are, but also we really not, you know what I mean? Like there's so much we don't know, even though we are, like we have so much magnificent knowledge, but um, we also don't know shit. <laughs> it's great. Dazzle or Wind Reaver? No. 
I wonder what hearts are gonna be like. Maybe it just gives you five things in a row rather than just the four symbols. Oh gosh, my brain's starting to go splat. <laughs> blue, pink, yellow, blue, blue, pink, yellow, blue. If I don't know shit, Phalanx of Garage, no. Pink, blue, pink, blue. Pink, blue, pink, blue. Blue, pink, yellow, pink. Blue, pink, yellow, pink. I don't know if first steps. No, Portuguese wisdom, I know it. Blue, pink, yellow, blue. Blue, pink, yellow, blue. <clears throat> As you a Drake, no. Gilded Prowler, no. Blue, pink, blue, pink. Blue, pink, blue, pink. There are some special designs to this mount that I was going to attempt to put on my face and then I realized if I did that it would be really obvious and the game would be over in about two seconds. So I just put all the colors on my face normally rather than doing a fancy design. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Ascended Sky Mane, nope. Jade Primordial Direhorn, nope. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. Check um Oh gosh, it's just me. I suck at these sort of memory games. I am like certain that there will be an add-on somewhere by now that you can like click on the colours like as they happen and it'll just save you like a log and then you just put them in with the action buttons or something. I, I imagine it'd be so simple to do. See you later. If there's not an add-on like that, I would be surprised. Astral Cloud Serpent, no. Pink, yellow, blue, pink. Pink, yellow, blue, pink. Remember there is more colors than just the blue-green kind of shade. Make sure you check Twitter for like up close photos. Pink, blue, pink, blue. Pink, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, Yellow, blue. Yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Ah, uh, Pestilinicre. No, latest book from the same people who brought you the epic healing series, Coloring by Numbers with Fia. Hello, Kaz, how are you going? Welcome back. Subtle way to plug the Twitter, I love it. Look, that was not my intention, but absolutely. While you're at it, go follow me on Instagram. 
I lost two followers since last stream and then I got another two back. But I know that one of them is going to unfollow me because they sent me a DM saying, please DM our main account if you are interested in our ambassador program, blah, 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 blah. Um, so I replied and said, let me know what you're looking for in a sponsored post and I'll send over my rates. So I have a feeling they're going to unfollow me very, very soon. Um. <laughs> Sandstone Drake, no. Pond Nettle, no. Oh. Mm, crunch. All right. Hello. See you around. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow. Let me fit this one on that sort of thing. We need to inflate their follow count. Yeah. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. I get it though. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. I I do get it because like I, I understand where they're coming from, but yeah, it's um nah. Pink, blue, yellow, pink. Pink, blue, yellow, pink. What I get on every single post is one to five. Promote it on at Epic Streamers, etc., etc. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, pink, blue. Basically, these, these Instagram accounts have like hundreds of thousands of followers that are all bots, probably. Uh, blue, yellow, pink, blue blue yellow pink blue and i what they want you to do is dm them and then they will charge you x amount of dollars to repost one of your posts and tag you the idea being that you get a ton of exposure and all those like two three four five hundred thousand people see your post and then a portion of them will end up following through to you to follow you that so you like it's it's you're paying for exposure um, it's, it's essentially buying followers without going to a buying followers website. Um, because those, those kind of accounts out of their 200 K, like 7% of them maybe might be real. The other 93 are all bots and all of those bots are programmed to like 60% of the posts. And they're all programmed so that when, when they post and they tag somebody, these bots will go and go to the tag and follow it. So it looks like you're actually getting the exposure and getting more followers, but they're fake. They'll never engage with any of your content. They'll never do anything um, unless they've programmed them to do so, but it's still, it's all fake shit. So yeah, it's, um, I'm trying to avoid doing that kind of shit. I was, there was a time uh, where I was going through and every time there was a comment like that, I was reporting it for spam and deleting it, but it just took so much time because there's just so goddamn many of them. And they're never going to go away. Like, it's just too easy to make a new Instagram account and go for it, you know? Like, it's it's so, so easy to do. Um, so, yeah. And I don't really have time to, to sit there and report them and, and stuff. So, yeah, it's just a bit shit. I just hope that there aren't, like, smaller streamers who are, like, following me and then they see those comments and then they go through and, and try to do the thing themselves as well, you know? Um... Chittering Atomite, no. Yellow Karaji Battle Tank, no. Hello, Mentu, how are you going? Welcome back. Blonde Riding Yak, no. Yellow Marsh Hopper, no. God, I'm molting so fucking bad. How are you? <sighs> I'm gonna refresh this because I feel like this is not. Okay. Cool. Let's go. Another hydrate. Uh, Zareth Overseer. What is that? Do I have that? Uh, no. Blue. Yellow. Pink. Ah, oh, shit. I've done the wrong thing. Wimp out. God damn it. Which means I've spent my last token on the wrong thing as well. Damn it! Okay, that's right. Where's my Argent Gruntling? Because I have 18 of them in my ba in my bank. Do 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 do
I was like, this is going really slow. Why is it taking so slow for the symbols to happen? I was a bit confused. Blue, yellow, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue. Um, better get the type own details. I'm out of ideas. Uh, yeah, so I, I own it. It's a ground mount. Um, but that's okay. It's, uh, like, blue-green, like, old gold, like, darker, dusty sort of stuff, and then, like, just a touch of mustard yellow. Just a touch. Did I get the achievement? I did get the achievement. Alright, good. Let's refresh, because it'll cross that off the list. Ta-da! And now, the hardest difficulty. Uh, so you're outside the tent for this game. Fantastic! Safe travel. Awesome. Hail High Die Horn. No. Surreal. Alune, bless my feet and let me glow with your radiance. Oh dear. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, yellow. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, yellow. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow, blue. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow, blue. Blue, pink, blue, pink, blue. Blue, pink, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, blue, yellow, pink. Uh, tonight we'll be hearing blue, yellow, pink, blue, yellow in our dreams. Indeed. Indeed. Alliance Horde neutral? Yeah, I reckon, I reckon it might be time. Um, neutral. It's a neutral mount. Itchy chin. Uh, for those of you who are locked behind an ad, uh, it is a neutral mount. What can I do for you? <clears throat> blue, yellow, blue, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, blue. Wilfred A stir. <laughs> yellow, blue, pink, yellow, blue. Yellow, blue, pink, yellow, blue. I love them the pun names, like the the Easter egg names. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. Pestilent Necro, nope. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Yellow, blue, yellow, pink, blue. 
yellow, blue, yellow, pink, blue. Amber Primordial Dihorn. You got it. So the, the little splash of mustard yellow I have up the top here is uh, is the color of the chair. Um, the the old gold kind of shade, it, look, it's really difficult to find this particular, this is not a nice shade to put on skin. So it is the closest I could get was like a dusty grayish kind of gold sort of shade. And then the the swirls here is the the little pop of blue green that I have on the, on the inner corner there. Um, I know it wasn't quite on the mark, but look, I, I tried. <laughs> I tried. Uh, see, is what I finally caught on to. Just a touch of mustard yellow. Uh, do you have a number for me, Shiva? What was the thing that you left out? The swirls. Instead of just putting the blue on my lid like that, um, I was thinking of mixing it with some Duraline and drawing like actual swirls and stuff, but um, didn't because it would have made it a little bit too obvious. Three for Sheba. Three. There we go. Trail makers. There you go. As well. Okay, let us continue. <clears throat> Safe traveling. I've really done two. Good lord. Pink. Blue, pink, yellow, blue. Pink, blue, pink, yellow, blue. Okay, pretty pricey too. Ah, oh, nice! Awesome. Pink, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Pink, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, pink, blue, yellow, blue. Yellow, pink, blue, yellow, blue. Do this game. Yay! Oh, awesome. Yellow, pink, blue, pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, blue, pink, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, yellow. How are you? Uh, okay, next one. See. Have you heard the crowd throw tomatoes at you yet when you do badly? It's hilarious. Uh, no, I haven't. I've only done perfect runs. I haven't made any mistakes yet. So I have not yet experienced that. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. <clears throat> Blue, pink, blue, pink, blue. Blue, pink, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue, pink, blue. Pink, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Pink, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, 
Yellow, pink, blue, pink, blue. Yellow, pink, blue, pink, blue. And another one. What can I do for you? Have a good one. Give me my achieves. Oh, excuse me. Pink, blue, pink, yellow, pink. Pink, blue, pink, yellow, pink. Yellow, pink, blue, yellow, blue. Yellow, pink, blue, yellow, blue. <clears throat> yellow, blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Blue. Yellow, pink, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, pink, yellow, pink, blue. Blue, pink, yellow, pink, blue. And another. Is there any music desire on? Um, for the. Wait. The raid? So. Um, I very, very, very almost made. A mythic bod run a um stream community goal this month blue yellow blue yellow pink blue yellow blue yellow pink my concern was if i committed to a raid like that because it was a bonus thing and then no one showed up and we couldn't kill things blue yellow blue yellow blue Blue, yellow, blue, yellow, blue. Because you still need, like, a solid raid team to do that stuff. Um, like, people who can do mechanics and stuff like that. Pink, blue, yellow, blue, pink. Pink, blue, yellow, blue, pink. Um, so I was a little bit nervous about making it a thing because I know you guys would rally and get it done, but then would we actually get the raid done? Blue, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, blue. Uh, if you plan for one, I certainly join in my shorter mog. I want drops from there. Well, like, all the mog and all the things. Like, there's, there's so much in there. Plus the achievements. It's the achievements I want to do. Like, I, I actually had a look and it turns out I, it looks like I've done all... I, it looks like I've done the meta for BOD. Um, but I haven't done... I, I think... But what I, all I haven't done was the um, the stuff on Mythic. I still haven't done Mythic, Cahoon. Jesus. Uh, mythic, 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 Mythic. Yeah, it's literally just the end of the expansion on Mythic that I haven't done from from Cahoon onwards to clear out that category of because I mean I've like all of these are clocked. I've I've done all of these achievements, right? Um, I would like to to cross off the next one on the list, but um, yeah. Hey but you you still need a solid team. Like I'm I'm not talking about like seven people who can do their jobs. I'm talking like fifteen who know how to like who are going to do the mechanics. <laughs> yeah, you still you still need a decent amount of people.
I have a normal Zokyo on my blood base timing. Blue, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, pink, blue, pink. I think this is the first time I've gone up against a uh, blood elf. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, yellow. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, yellow. Pink, blue, pink, blue, pink. Pink, blue, pink, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, blue. Blue, yellow, blue, pink, blue. Pink, blue, pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, pink, blue, yellow. Uh, that's not me. Yeah, it's um because it's it's only last expansion, like it's only last expansion. It's still very recent, uh, and there are a lot of mechanics in there. Although you know they may not be one shots anymore, they'll knock you low enough that if you take another hit, then you'll probably die. Do you know what I mean? You still need actual healers and tanks and stuff like that. But that's okay. You need something? Have a good one. <clears throat> oh, three to go. Pink, blue, pink, blue, pink. Pink, blue, pink, blue, pink. Pink, yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Pink, yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Pink, blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow, pink. Pink, yellow, blue, yellow, pink. Yellow, pink, blue, pink, yellow. Pink, blue, pink, yellow. Oh, two more rounds, and then I can turn my brain off a little bit. <laughs> Mythic Hoon is still really, really difficult if you don't know what you're doing. Yep. Yep. You can't just rely on one or two people to do all the mechanics while everyone else just smashes stuff. Like, everyone has to actually participate in the, in the fight. Like, there is a minimum number of people you require to be able to successfully complete the encounter because there is a mechanic that you can only do once to, for each person. Like, each person can only participate in this mechanic once, so you need everyone to be able to do it. And if one group fucks it up, that whole group, like, if one person fucks it up, that whole group can't do it again. So you need, like, a backup group. Like, it's, yeah, it's a whole thing. Uh, next expansion, they'll start putting effort into making them soluble, I bet. Uh, look, it took a while for them to start making other stuff soluble. Um, so, like, Legion was only done, like, halfway through Shadowlands. More than halfway through Shadowlands is when they made the changes to make Legion bosses soluble. So we'd be looking at halfway through next expansion, which at this point we're looking about two years away before they start, like, if, if it follows the same pattern. Ah, uh, what about a green? Just for a change. Yeah, there is no green button. There's only the three. It's just yellow, pink, and blue. Sorry to disappoint. Hello. Safe travels. Pink, blue, pink, blue, yellow. Pink, 
Blue, pink, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, pink, yellow, blue. Pink, blue, pink, yellow, blue. Pink, blue, yellow, blue, yellow. Pink, blue, yellow, blue, yellow. <laughs> yellow, pink, blue, yellow, blue. Yellow, pink, blue, yellow, blue. <clears throat> Pink, yellow, pink, yellow, pink, pink, yellow, pink, yellow, pink. Running battle. Ah, yeah, touch light. I'll trigger that when we get out of here. Um, actually, I'll do that now. And on your more Blizzard, of course, of course. Hello, Onslaught. What is this? I've never seen this in WoW. Dark Moon Fair. It's uh, not super new, but it is relatively new. It's one of the newest, uh, like, dailies that you can do in Dark Moon Fair now to get tickets and stuff. It's super cute, isn't it? Welcome on in, Onslaught. Hope you're having a fantastic day. And I have one more round to do before I do all the, before all the achievements get ticked off. Ah, oh, that screen perfection. Say blue again. I dare you. Yep. I had no idea. And hi, hello, hello. Yeah, I've been meaning to check it out for a while, but I just haven't had a chance. And uh, so last month I had a uh, a Dark Moon Fair. Uh, community challenge, you know, with the embers in underneath the chat box, you can like contribute points to, to unlock like a, a special thing or whatever. Last month, one of the special things to unlock was a Dark Moon Fair stream. Um, and so that's what we're doing today. Uh, so these are the first things I'm crossing off my list, finishing off the achievements. Thank you, Chrome, for your contribution to this week's challenge. Uh, TikTok A Tale for Two is a puzzle game that's available on Steam. It is a two player game. You have to play it with two people because each player only gets to see half of the details and then you have to work together and communicate to to solve the puzzles and to move on through the storyline. Um, and it would be hilarious to watch Jas and I at each other's throats trying to get these puzzles done. So uh, it was suggested by a sub and uh, and here we are with the goal. So if we can hit, uh, if we hit 50% completion tonight we'll be on track to finish it by the time like the the deadline arrives uh trig ali zam bod and draz congratulations to all of you on your bonus shits well done oh it's a token chest if you would like some bonus tokens for your your battle pass for the pixel shogunate event in stream readers this is the battle to join drag and drop those follow the link in chat log in with your twitch account and drag and drop those units to the battlefield participate and win yourself some bonus tokens bonus tokens hello crumb how you going welcome back oh. i said okay come on <laughs> i have placed my warriors come on it's having a Having some trickies, isn't it? There we go. Okay. One more round. Let's do it. What have you fucking did it? Yeah. <laughs> Well done, Shiba. Well done. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow, blue. Blue, yellow, pink, yellow, blue. Yellow, blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, blue, yellow, pink, yellow. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. Yellow, blue, pink, blue, pink. 
Hey, Anab, doing well. How are you going today? Welcome back. Pink, blue, pink, yellow, blue. Pink, blue, pink, yellow, blue. One more round. I'm excited. Blue, yellow, pink, blue, pink. Blue, yellow, pink, blue, pink. All the achievements. Uh, don't stop dancing, maniac on the dance floor and dancing machine. All completed. So once we do this, all those achievements will poof, disappear. Actually, no, they won't because I haven't loaded the toy yet. Toy! Learnt. There we go. Alright, so I'm going to minimise prize ticket. Prize ticket. Uh, because I'm fairly certain Fear's still trying to save up for the goddamn dirigible. Um, it should be like the pale purple colour. The mounts. Because I've still got a couple mounts I need. Oh no, just the one mount. But yeah, it's a thousand tickets. It's a few. I have got this on account in wide mode, which is why there's so much stuff. Um, how many does she have? Out of curiosity. 54. Good. Super close. Awesome. Wonderful. <laughs> um, Alright. Okay, so a new dark moon. Chaldendra. Okay, that is some digital operation. Well, yeah, yeah. It uh, like I had a couple of complications afterwards, but they resolved within a week, which was really good. And yeah, I'm I'm feeling pretty good about it. It's still really weird. Like every time my tongue goes over there, like it it just feels odd, like super super odd. Um, but yeah, overall, overall feeling pretty good. That's enough gabbing for me today. I'm glad that you're glad. Any friend of Grey Mane is a friend of mine. Am I a friend of Grey Mane? I don't think I am. Pretty sure Greyman's fairly pissed with me. Oh, I don't have a script for this one. Okay, that's fine. Uh, Dazzling Dance. <laughs> Flurry. But I do. Don't know. Oh, no, it's team preferences. Flurry again. Then I howl, repeat flurries and howl until Sid dies. Right. That's not great. Uh, okay, so wind up. <laughs> yeah, I'm in a super bad position for this. Uh, that's all right. So, wind up. Supercharge. Wind up. God damn it. <laughs> yeah, this is not gonna work. And then there's Baal, who is gonna die very quickly. <laughs> Okay. What do I Ain't you a chipper looking one? Do -do 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 -do. 
Uh, what's my starlet? Get crit by auto. Okay, alright. This should be okay. Overwrite the existing team. This is Christoph von Fiesel. And we're going to pop this in and see how we go. Alright. Let's try that again. <clears throat> I'm glad that you. Wow, okay, and you got there, I guess. What? I'm so. What happened? I'm confused. Uh, I finally got my four piece tier set my hunter. I'm looking for legendary, and now I get so many aim shots, I end up hit. I get a stationary artillery? Oh no! <laughs> 2900 casts and still nothing. Oh, Shiba. Ah, uh, you get a lot of spells. Oh, so high. Hey, Maka. Yeah, a lot of them aren't spells. I just have a lot of bar space, um, is what's actually going on. I don't have any more, any more spells than anybody else does. But, um, yeah, no, I, I like having stuff being just like one click away. So my professions are on my bars. If I've got something like disenchanting, that's on my bars so that I can like easily just kind of click click or actually I think that's bound as well. I'm pretty sure that one's bound. Um, but yeah, I just, yeah, like to have things uh, pretty close. I've also got a lot of macros for things like dropping waypoints. If I'm farming for a particular collectible, uh, I can hit that, it'll drop all the waypoints and then I can go check them all rather than having to like go grab a copy paste every time. Uh, makes things a little easier. But yeah. Right, this is not... Oh no, wait, no, swap to your iron broom. Okay, your enchanted broom. Okay, maybe it is going okay. <clears throat> mm. Yeah, okay, that did not work so well. Auto must have crit me. Oh, whoops. That's the one I wanted. Uh, I just want to touch my DMF like grinding stuff. Oh, I know the feeling. I know the feeling. Uh, is there a pet healy person around here or not? Tokens, but like, I wonder if my Argent Grunling has reset yet. I'll grab some bandages out of the bank. Yeah. Not, not yet. Damn it! Is there a pet Healy person around here? I might have to go into Thunder Bluff. Hey Akin, how you doing? Uh, what is... Oh, 
What are you struggling with? Uh, finding the closest NPC to heal my battle pets. I think I'm just gonna get a sound of bluff. I'm... My brain is not functioning. No Avengers. Yeah, they're in the bank because I don't usually carry them around because I take up too much. Yeah. That's right. And mage, don't care. Okay. Pick those up. Nice and easy. Yeah, it's been a while since I've updated a lot of my pet battle strategies in rematch. Uh, and of course, Shadowlands did a whole lot of messing around with how stuff worked. So a lot of the old teams and strategies don't work anymore. I've just kind of been updating them as I've encountered the battles. And I haven't been to Darkmoon Fair in a long while, so... Well, oh, so it's probably gonna go out soon. How are you? Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. Bit, bit tired. Kind of a bit run down. Uh, but apart from that, doing really well. Doing really well. Okay, let's give this another try, shall we? What can I do for you? Keep your chin up. Right? Okay. So we sweep. If the strat fails, it is because Iron Starlet dies too early. In this case, you have to break the bubble on Sid with your Enchanted Broom. For this, you have to use Batter after you brought your Enchanted Broom in. When the bubble is broken, then continue to the strat as described. Okay. Okay, so the bubble's broken, so we should be fine. Welcome in tonight. Thank you, Keggy. How you going? Welcome back. Every time I think to myself, finally, I don't have to stress anymore. My dentist tells me something to stress about. Yep. Yep. At least my dentist gave it all to me at once, and it's like, here you go. It's going to cost you $23,000 to fix all this. I was like, cool, thank you. Uh, have you been doing any Sepulchre raid, by the way? Yeah, a little bit. Um, early on, I did a couple of raids. Uh, haven't for a few weeks, just because of everything else that's been going on. Um, but yeah, I did enjoy what I did. I think I got to seven. I got up to Anduin. We didn't kill Anduin, but I got up to Anduin on um, on normal. It was good fun. I enjoyed it. Posture check. Happy, uh, oh. I'm just leaning over Zam. Oh my god. <laughs> It's insane. Yeah, it's, um, I, I have bad teeth. I have bad teeth. But after all this, hopefully I'll have slightly better, stronger teeth. Alright, so that one's done. Let the 
light of the new moon guides you. And then we have the other one. Get Gabin or get going. Why does that not go any higher? That's really strange. Oh, I wonder if this one will probably not work anymore as well. Give it a go. Long. We are bound by a common enemy. Posture your check, young lady. We'd actually get Tuesday tonight. Hey, Jess. Does that mean you're home? Oh. Mm, do so people, some people just have to look at a candy bar. It's like, congrats, here's eight cavities. Others brush their teeth once a week with that issue. Yep. I'm definitely the the first group. First group. I'm going to force it on my main hunter. So this is unlucky me. You're home? Awesome. Welcome home. No more injuries today? Very dramatic music. Oh, the pet battle music's awesome. I like it a lot. It's the, um, apparently it's Warcraft Orcs and Humans remastered. Like, that's what this music is. Which is, I think, is just so cool. Sound of familiar? Yep. Uh, okay. Cool. So that's done. And I can open that bag. Good. Uh, so there's nothing else to do under the battle pet section today. Uh, but fishing. Dark moon fishing cap. What is this? How do I get this? Do I have to fish it up? Uh, rut row. Or is it one that costs a number of fish? <clears throat> Fished in. Oh, Jesus Christ.
Okay. Rarity string fished in open waters in DMF. <sighs> hey, Sheebs. I'm a joining ya. That's not what I wanted. My interface. I'm joining you. I, I hate to even... Where did it put it? Custom? Must have put it in custom. <sighs> One in 2500. Apparently. According to the person who did up this rarity string. Um... The shut up. <laughs> oh, portal back. Is that new? That feels new. with me. However, if you get what you're after before I get the group, I will rage quit. <laughs> Stealing all the fishing luck? Nah. Nah. Alright, before I begin the self-torture, I will be back. I do have a chair stream. Uh, I'm going to make use of that. I'll be, I'll be.
stay a while and listen. I'm I'm pretty sure I have everything I need from the fish here, but I guess we'll find out. Um, <laughs> you like the new cherry moat? Many thanks, Toshiba. That's super cute, hey. We should get the group right now. Yup. Updated chair. It is chip. The the emote is chip because it's purple chair, and we wanted to keep the green one as well because like. You know, oh, for God's sake. Every so often my, like, cursor glitches out. Um. I'm trying. Shit. Oh, I haven't done that one yet, Kaz. Um, had some stuff happen over the last couple of days, unfortunately. Is there an elite turn chieftain? Yeah. Let's look at the as well. Let's kill the team. How are you? They're trying to do. to. Or in Shiba's case, do not. Ooh. Ooh. All right, there are... Apparently there are three things that I don't have for the Dark Moon Dagamore still. So that's nice. <laughs> wow, why didn't that work? Uh, because you're using exclamation, which is how you interact with bots, rather than slash, which is how you interact with Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Dono. Uh, it's a bracket for the dominance key. Mm. Oh dear. She was slow. Top mood. <laughs> you now stop believing me. So, it is 4 a.m. East Coast, North America. There you go. Uh, it is 6 07 p.m. on Wednesday here in Brisbane. Na 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 Severed Crimson Scale Head, Unique 5, Use, Wear the Fish Head. Uh, Zam, Fade, Martin, Moo, and Trig, congratulations to all of you on your bonus shit. Well done. Onwards we go, hope you all got an amazing amount of tokens. Two dead aims, short term goal, we get 100% in these earth waters. Now, ET added mythic tier items. So that plans out the window. Um, it shouldn't have added tier items to Zerith Mortis. That's a separate zone. Um, that's. Like, that's the raid zone. That's interesting. Or do you mean mythic plus tier items? Because they can be crafted there or something. That's really odd. What category is it under?
Like out of those categories, like which which categories? I don't know. Vendor. Fake. Those are all Sandborn Relic ones. That's all of Rafik stuff. And Velo is the Quartermaster. Where's the... Where are the Mythic... There's no tier items here. It might be the item to, like... I don't know, do like to make the tier pieces or something. But that's not, it's not there. Video version called Creation Catalyst Console. Oh, that's a bit odd. Okay. No craft tier from Sam Wood Relic Vendor Gear, is that it? No. No. Craft all levels of tier of the Creation Catalyst so it makes sense. Yeah. Is there an option to like... What you might do... Um, what you might want to do is jump into their Discord and let them know that, you know, th this is... I understand that it's transmog that can be crafted while you are in Xerath Mortis using something from a Xerath Mortis vendor but it also requires sepulchre gear to like actually craft it. So it shouldn't, it should be in sepulchre, not in ZM. And see if they like, I mean, they might argue with you until you know that's what the data says and so that's where it's staying. But um, in terms of like actual completion levels, I can't imagine that many people who are looking to get zones to 100% are also mythic rating. It doesn't require sepulchre gear. What does it require? What else does it require? Craft it with damn near any piece from S3. Yeah, but that's still endgame content, Jas. You you failing to grasp my point, which is people who are completionists who are working through to complete zones and stuff like that may not have the capability of doing high level mythic pluses or mythic rating. And so those items should come from those it, like yeah, it's if 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 the if it can be crafted with a piece from Halls of Atonement. It should come under Halls of Atonement. If it can be crafted with a piece from Sepulchre, it should come under Sepulchre. If they share an appearance, then that's fine. That's easy to manage. But it shouldn't be dropping from ZM because it's not. It's it's stuff that requires stuff outside of ZM. It requires gear from someone really fender, not raid gear. That was added in a hotfix. Yeah, but that's not mythic tier, K. Okay? Mythic tier looks different. So if the mythic tier pieces are appearing in that list as well, then that's an entirely separate argument. You can you can craft like normal or, or maybe heroic or whatever from someone, but I doubt that you can do that. To, like I doubt that you can upgrade vendor gear to mythic level quality without doing mythic rating or high level mythic class. Extreme readers withdrawals. You know, there's an app like a phone app, yeah, Midi. Is that achievement farming going? Oh, I've done the achievements that were on the list. I'm working on com like completing everything, not just achievements. Um, so at the moment, there's a hat that's a 1 in 2500 drop rate from fishing, so that's what I'm doing. <clears throat> I would argue it is almost more the rule than the exception the collectors isn't doing in-game content. Yeah, um... I... Look, I don't think we can say with certainty which way it goes because we don't know most of the player base. We may know the people that we play with, we may know the communities that we're a part of, but that's going to be highly biased towards our style of play. We don't know. There may well be a huge chunk of Echo that loves mount farming. We, we don't know. Like, um, so yeah, I'd, I'd hesitate to make like a massive generalization like that, but what I can say is that some collectors don't have that capability. And I think that's reasonable. Yeah, confirmation bias. Yep, exactly. Where is this vendor? Zero with Mortis. Uh, being able to craft it with ZM gear depends on how high cyber gear can go, even if it can be used. Yeah. 
Look, um, it, it might just be worth jumping into the Discord anyway, Jay, and just asking, like, hey, I've noticed this has popped up, take a screenshot. It's like, I was hoping to 100% ZM, but I can't craft this gear because I don't do endgame content in that, like, I don't do that kind of endgame content. Um, is this meant to be here? Does this make sense to be here? Why is this here? Even just asking the question rather than demanding for it to be moved. Um, not active yet, it opens next week. There you go. Yeah, maybe I haven't updated it to TMU, that's why it's not showing up. <laughs> Alright, so I need to do, so that quests one, the Dark Green Game Token, Dark Green Game Prize, that's just doing the dailies, and I know that there's a, um, there's a guide for that, so that'll be easy. Demon's Deck. I feel like that's old demon's deck poor it goes for a bit Dark Moonfair does not have to be in town for you to get decks, get the items. So, transmog from quests. When you choose an item, you automatically get all the items you didn't choose as transmog, but only if that character can use them, right? So if I were to turn in a demon's deck, for example, and there's a, a dagger, a two-handed axe, and a two-handed staff, I'd only get two out of the three on fear. I would be better off creating a demon's deck and completing the quest on the warrior because they can use everything except glaives, right? Um, yeah. Uh, yeah, that's what Jas was saying, Kaz. Um, I think you're agreeing with him with that comment. Um, I get to craft one piece next week. Oh, I can't choose the dagger on a mage because it's agility, but I could, should still get the... Um, yeah, you know, this doesn't change your gear's appearance. That's interesting then. It might be just, like, the tier gear. Like, the, I, I can't see an ATT, I, I'm guessing it's because I haven't un, un, uh, updated it yet, but Jay's, uh, Jay's original statement was around the fact that there's mythic tier gear in the Zerith Mortis outdoor zone section um, for, for ATT therefore can no longer 100% it because chances of getting tier gear, mythic tier gear are slim to nil or cra even crafting it. Um, but if it doesn't change the appearance, that's really interesting, then why would it even be in there to start with? Uh, it changes its appearance and stat weightings. There you go. So it does change it. Uh, you only keep the eye level... I think it changes the appearance, could be wrong, not sure they'll find it next week. Rest changes to the two base. There you go. So it does change the appearance. Which is really interesting. So is anyone able to answer my question? 
<laughs> Does anyone know about what I asked? Uh, <laughs> So I'm going to use Adam ID and Capital Copy different ID. You got to get each version. Not if you're not doing um, every item completion thingy. Like I like uh, what's it called? If it's shared appearances, once I get one, it's it's fine. Like. Like you know there one ticked off because I've actually got it and then the other one's just like you know semi ticked off and then the other one's whatever like it, it doesn't care um but I mean yeah depends on how you want to roll um prescription all good Kay thank you thanks anyway hey nerd how you going welcome on in I accidentally hit mute of course you did uh, so demons deck is one of the th like one of the next things on my list on DMF is the demons deck. There's three items. Once you complete the deck and turn it in, you get a dark moon dirk, a uh, dark moon executioner, or the dark moon mage staff. On the mage, I'll only have the choice of the mage staff. I'll have to accept that, but it should also give me the transmog for the dirk because I can use that. But it sh I don't think it will give me the executioner appearance because I can't use two handed axes. So does that mean I would be better off doing the demon's deck quest on a warrior to unlock all three? Is is that still how it works? I'm just not too sure. Mm, of course it does, it's mythic eye level. Good, just playing before work. Wonderful. Wonderful, shipping might be a good idea to avoid decision paralysis. Yeah, if someone really crafted tier could be upgraded to mythic that might be why it's there or can sand one relic gear be upgraded the reason jas was talking about retaining its upgrade ability that's from mythic plus you can upgrade mythic plus gear with valor can you upgrade sand one relic gear i don't know i haven't checked if that's not upgradable then no it doesn't yeah um i think yes okay kaz all right that's that's cool um the deck is probably going to be Bullshit expensive anyway. Oh, there's not even any. Yeah, zero auctions. Perfect. Um, what about the. So, two and a half, zero auctions, 1k, zero auctions, 200 gold. Good lord. But also, apparently, like, these are. There's zero auctions for each of them, but they're BOE. Like, the, the rewards from that quest are BOE, which is really funny. So maybe I won't get all the appearances, because you could grab it and then sell it. I might have to actually do it thrice to get them all. I do same stuff as well. Gradable, same as fixed level, I think. Nobody's been able to test that either, Nab. That's what it's been rumored to do. Nobody knows, because nobody's ever been able to swap to do it yet. Right, so all of everything that you guys are saying then is all just up in the air bullshit. Like, none of it's actually confirmed. Because <laughs> you're all saying it with such certainty, but none of you know anything. Because it can't be, it hasn't been tested. Like, come on. It's alright, I'm not going to need to do anything with the demon's deck tonight anyway because I'm going to spend the rest of the bloody stream fishing. The note on the menu is also, this thing is a disgrace for comp players, so they might be aware they had to put the item somewhere, but no, it has to change. Um, I doubt that it has to change. I, I reckon what that means is that they're really, really sorry, but this is where the data goes. Like, there, there is nowhere else that it fits correctly. It has to go here, but it sucks. I don't, I don't think that they're saying it has to change. <laughs> I think they're just saying it sucks. Um, so the two from Nicholas, well, those two works the same. But it's okay, like, I mean, give it a give it an expansion or two and we'll be able to do it. It'll be fine. 
Looks like it is on PTO only. Lol, why are you fishing? Because there's stuff that drops from fishing that I don't have yet. I'm a collector, that's what I do. Why are you laughing? <laughs> um, not least for certain, only thing I knew was Sam really good can be crafted into tier. Certainly, I caveat everything! Cannot test on PTR, it's non-functional unless you've ground out the entire questline on PTR. Uh, also you have to move the gifts here and Bella. Um, yeah, so what I'm doing, uh, there's a Dark Moon fishing cap. And it, it's the fish, the chance to fish it up is one in 2,500 casts. Obviously that doesn't mean that it's going to take me 2,500 casts, but it also means it could take me 10,000. Um, <laughs> so yeah, I, uh, last month we had a, a stream community challenge thing. We've got another one running right now, actually. Um, but last month, one of them was a Dark Moon completionist stream. Uh, so jumping into ATT, opening up Dark Moon Island, and getting as much of it done as possible, getting that completion percentage as high as possible. Um, and I've done a whole bunch of achievements today. I, I scored a whole uh, a whole bunch of them. Uh, everything to do with the dancing, the new dancing daily. Uh, I finished all of those off, polished them off, got the got the toy, uh, and then I did the battle pet stuff, um, hoping to get drops from the 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 reward bags, but that's okay. Uh, and then the next one on the list is fishing, so that's what I'm doing, and um, as I do most of the time, regretting my life's choices. <laughs> so, <laughs> is it going to take 11,000? Yeah, probably. I need 550 fishies for mount and recipe. Yeah, I've got the mount. Apparently there are three, is this currency for extra fancy dark moon feast, extra lemony herb fill, and extra sugary fish feast. I don't know what they actually are though. Oh, it's the three recipes. Okay. So one of them is 50, 10, and 25. So I've got, I've got all those already. So I can, I could go buy them now. In fact, I actually might because that'll make me feel better. This is from the cooking person. Okay. Let's go buy these just so I can cross them off the list as well because that'll feel nice. Correct. Uh, but that does mean I can sell the rest of the dagger more and it looks like they're going for like nearly 20 gold a pop. So that's pretty good. Um, Did you buy the dark moon turn in items? No, not yet. Because that's not like what I'm working on exactly just yet. Um, I've done that in the past. Um, oh, this is not, oh god, okay, a toy fit, yep, gotcha. Um, Galissa. Where's Galissa? Not here. <laughs> Oh, is she? Maybe is she down by the dock? That would make sense, being this is all fish stuff. Yeah. There she is. Your gold is welcome here. Okay, extra fancy. Dark Moon Feast. Extra Lemony Herb Fillet. And Extra Sugary Fish Feast. Interesting that that's not highlighted as... Wait. Ah! Whoops, wrong one. What do you see? An extra Fancy Dark Moon Feast. Be ready for anything. Wonderful. Done! The extra music is because I completed a category. FYI. In case you've not heard that before, that's what that means. You get the same same stuff plays when you finish a dungeon or a raid. Um... There we go, he's hoping it's not a goop situation. I hope not. I don't know why you're getting your current life choices, because I'm spending another goddamn stream fishing. 
<laughs> uh, just eating game ones, I think, Ellie. Um, I've done the secret thingy, costs 100 fish. Uh, I don't know. That's entirely too vague. <laughs> also, remember that my memory is not good. Uh, but considering that ATT says I've got 10 out of 10 Dark Moon Dagamore things that I don't need, like I don't need them for anything else completion wise, I'd say it's probably a safe bet that I've done it. Um, for those who want to try fishing for and DMF, it's a good idea to do so in front of Bunny Cave unless you were fear and had it drop without knowing it was rare. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Soz. Trying to level sucks. Oh, why? I really enjoy leveling. Uh, as you can probably tell by this list of my alts. There are 50 of them. And the lowest level is 50. I have five 60s now. And the rest of them are between 50 and 55. Uh, sounds like cat food. Extra fancy dark green feast. Yep. I, I, yep. Totally feel that, dude. I feel like I wouldn't know how it, like, to clear a category seven, huh? Oh, haven't you yet? I, really? I mean, I'm, as you phrased it, I'm on casual mode. So, uh, I guess that probably helps, right? Colin de Brain. Yep. Exactly right, dude. Exactly. How are we going? Almost at 100 casts. Fucking casual, <laughs> and I'm fucking loving it. Correct. Aerial stuff, etc., etc. Enjoy, Kaz. We'll see you soon, no doubt. No, no. <laughs> oh, we go and trust me. I did a lot of things, like ninety-five percent plus. Yeah, yeah. I'm uh. If I take this off account mode, I'm getting pretty good on fear. Um, like, oh, why is this still? There we go. The only raid I have left from Classic is Temple, and there's only five things I need from that. Like, I'm doing pretty okay. Crossing things off as I go. It's been fun. It's been fun. Not on all classes, obviously. I've still got a lot to do on the other classes, but um, that's what Sundays are for. Sundays we do account-wide 12 classes, dungeons and raids, up to and including Legion. But um, when I have, you know, a moment here or there, um, I've been trying to go from, like, oldest to newest. I've um, been trying to go down Fear's list and, and try to 100% a bunch of stuff. AT Dart, exclamation AT Dart, A-T-D-A-R-T, um, in chat will get you my spreadsheet. And all the little, all the blue lines on Fear are really nice. I like them. I like them. Now 90% chance of the Goober coin to ready. Oh my goodness. You get there. It'll drop. It's pretty solid. Classic is horrible. Yeah. Especially all the sets, like the, the class sets and stuff. So you get something that's plate that'll drop, but you're on a warrior and the plate's for paladin only and all that kind of crap. It's just really frustrating. Thankfully though, a lot of the BOEs, are, uh, a lot of the trash drops are BOE. Later on, when you've got trash drops that are bop, they can suck like all sorts of horrible things. Oh, we've hit a hundred. A hundred attempts so far. Uh, yeah, 3k plus costs 3523, there you go. Uh, 50% on all classes is my first goal. Nice, nice. I'm just, I keep, I'm, like, on, on Sundays, I just keep working through, like, whatever's my lowest percentage dungeon or raid. I just go with that. And try to push it up and then move on. I'm doing okay. Like, I'm pretty happy with how it's coming along. What was I? Overall, overall 
It's pretty damn good. And my lowest is 34.62. I do have a lot that are in the 30s and 40s, but um, yeah, I'm, I'm feeling pretty good about that. I'm going all right. I just hit level 16. Nice. Good luck. Enjoy, nerd. Well done. Oh, I have reached that amount, I'm sure. Hope you get it long before that. Alright, I'm off to make dinner. Enjoy your food, Kay. We'll see you soon. True set in my lowest and focus on that class of the week. Gotcha. Gotcha. Yeah, with, with Fia um doing her raids in particular, I haven't updated her her um actually I probably should do that now, shouldn't I? <laughs> Let's uncheck this. Um what would happen, like, if I was working on, for example, when I was working on Ruins, it got to the point where the only thing that was left was a piece of, like, uh, there were there were two pieces left. There were cloth boots, and there was a BOE trash drop wand. And so I ran through all of my cloth wearers trying to get that boot, like, try, trying to get those boots. Um, and then once the boots dropped, I switched to going through literally every single character I had I didn't obviously didn't get through them all in each week, but I, I got through as many characters as I could, hoping for that one to drop from trash, so that I could send it to Fia, so she could learn it, so she could cross it off, and so that's how it ended up happening. Like, if if the stuff that can drop from Fia could drop from other characters as well, then I'll farm it on all other characters to try to like more birds with one run. <clears throat> Why do these numbers keep changing? This is driving me batty. Like literally this number keeps, every time I refresh it's changing. There we go, it's stopped changing. There you go. Four classic raids, 100% complete, and the other one's at 94.05. Not bad at all. Mm. There you go, you finally have from work. Fantastic, Dunno. Hello. Good evening. I'm I'm doing okay. A bit tired. Um, head hurts a little. But overall doing okay. Overall doing okay. I'm just gonna keep doing the same thing repeatedly, like moving on to the next to my list. I have to go back for a week or a day, yeah. I am, um, I am quite stubborn. Ugh. But having those blue lines on the spreadsheet is really, really nice. Like when I finally see it there in the loot window being like, ah, hear the music, oh, makes me happy. But yeah, now like focusing on um, temple is like oof. Like the bop trash drops. Does him nice? Which, okay, not good to be sore. Yeah, just like sleepy. <laughs> just sleepy. Uh, 
classes. Hey! No decision move on for a while. Absolutely. Well done. Uh, Dano, Benko, Fade, Jara, and Trig, congratulations to all of you on your bonus shit. Well done. Ooh. I thought my headache was gone, and then it's just sort of like... I was, it almost felt like I could feel it moving into into my forehead. That's, um... That was an interesting sensation. Leveling my tunes, leveling my, well, not tunes really, they're leveling my units. Follow the link in chat, drag and drop your units to the battlefield. Join us. Join us. Uh, give me two, what is moving into your forehead? I had a headache just before stream started for like an hour or two, and I took some Nurofen, and I thought it was good, but then, like, just then as I was talking about it, it almost felt like... Like, this pain just kind of moved into my forehead, like, flowed there and then was just, like, sitting there, chilling like a dickhead. And I'm like, yeah, I don't know. Unhappy. <laughs> Sorry, Perk. That was, um, yeah, look. I can imagine that would have been fairly strange to come into. How are you? I hope you're well. Who's a Nurofen? Well, it's not actually Nurofen. It's, it's, um, uh... Uh, it's it's home brand, like it's pharmacy brand. Apotex ibuprofen, uh, but it was cheap as fuck. So, <laughs> I'm really enjoying twenty four hour block off of work. Wonderful perk. Congratulations. I've got work tomorrow, but that's okay. I don't mind my my work. It's uh you know desk job, so kind of easy. Ah, uh, can I see how cheap those large, large boxes are? Yeah. Yeah. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Oh, gosh, excuse me. Oh, we're doing secret finding on Friday. I forgot about that. That'll be fun. Which secret should we do? I think I'll probably put a poll up because there's only three. Okay, I lied. Um, there's a, a there's a tiny set of warglaves from Pepe um, from for the Demon Hunter. Um, maybe I should like put up a po I'll put up a poll on Friday and you lot can vote. I think that sounds like a good idea. The key, Jennifer. The good thing about getting here this week is a holiday starts next week. Hopefully I'm better by then. Yeah, fingers crossed. Denmark Pharmacy has to buy law off the cheapest all standards medicine news. We went from 75 euro to about 10. Yep. Yep. Some, like, my medication doesn't have, like, oh, quite a bit of my medication doesn't have a, like, a generic brand equivalent. Uh, because it's highly specialized medication. Um... So, yeah, but, like, in terms of, like, in Australia, it's the same thing. I don't know if it's a law thing. It it quite possibly could be. Um, it quite possibly, could, quite possibly could be a law thing. But, yeah, every time I go to the pharmacy, um, instead of even saying, do you want the generic brand, they say, generic brand, okay? Like, they grab it off the shelf and go, generic brand, okay? Cool. And then, like, yeah. So it, they, they kind of default to that these days. And then they'll tend to give you the, like, they'll tend to only pull the brand name stuff off the shelf if you specifically ask for, like, can I have this brand, blah, blah, blah. Um, I, but that's been like that for years, like years and years and years and years, like back since I was in uni and that's like, God, <laughs> a decade ago at this point. 
Um, so I think it's just such a normal, natural thing now. It's just reflex for them to just grab the generic off the shelf. Um, it's like waste time. Specialized medication sounds expensive. Uh, it is. My medication costs f uh, fourteen fifty a month. No cents. Fourteen hundred and fifty. One thousand four hundred and fifty dollars a month. In Australia, we have what's called the PBS, stands for Pharmaceutical Benefits Scheme. For my $1,450 worth of medication per month, I spend $45. The rest of it's paid for by the government. Um... That's just one medication. I have a bunch of different ones that I take for different things, but that's the big, that's the big chunky one. That's the big chunky one. Uh, Bloodoff and I have been quietly fishing out to each other for the past two hours. They've just left and now I feel sad. Oh, sheeps. We are here for you. I think the fish might be fighting just a touch. Uh, there's not many meds where it matters. Genetic brand. Yeah. Yeah, no. Generic brand stuff. It's often the exact same stuff. It, it's when it comes down to when you have really obscure allergies and things like that, it, it, because it's what they use as filler and binder and stuff like that, because the amount of drug in your drug isn't, like, if you ground it into a powder and grabbed a small piece of it, it's not, that's not pure drug. It's like, yeah, there's, there's binders in there that help it stick together as a pill and all that kind of stuff. And if you have allergies to very specific like binders and, and things like that, then it can absolutely matter which packet of pills you end up getting. Uh, but in it's in so, so few circumstances where it actually matters. Um, some people do feel more confident in the ability of branded medication to work over the generic brand. But that's, and you know, it's it's the placebo effect, you know, like, oh, I'm, I'm getting the more expensive stuff, the stuff that's brand name, therefore it will work better and then maybe it will. Um, but often that's not at all the case. It might be sometimes, but I, yeah, I've always just gone with generic stuff because it's a hell of a lot cheaper, if it's, if it's uh, possible. But yeah, things like um, birth control. Don't, there's no, like, there there are lower prices and then medium price and then high. There, like, there's a ton of different pills on the market, like a ton of different birth control pills on the market that are all very slightly different. And it absolutely matters which one of those you pick up because <laughs> it's like the one that you use because it works best for your body and your chemistry and stuff. Um, but the vast majority of medicines, yeah, generic medication is just as good for most people. For most people. Um, so it's permanent, you'd be trying to go for Tower Overwhelming. Uh, there's something on the schedule for that. Yeah, PBS, agreed. Agreed, in our family. Remember, chemo. Oh, do you mean chemo, like, C-H-E-M-O, like, chemotherapy? I'm like, chemo, I'm like, what, what chemo drug? And then when I said it aloud in my head, I was like, oh, maybe that's what they mean. Unless you're talking about a specific drug that's called chemo spelt like that. Um, Medicare, 100, yeah. Yeah, like, yeah, the, well, yeah, the PBS is kind of like a tangential part of Medicare. And it, yeah, it helps like a lot. It helps like a lot, a lot. Um, medication past couple years now. So really thankful for 100% coming in prescription. It's been now. It never fails to blow my mind. It's amazing, isn't it? The human mind is just what the hell? What the actual hell? Um, home brand vasectomy. That's not a drug. Vasectomy is not a drug, dupe. Uh, there's a difference in hormone, non-hormone. Yeah, of course. But that's different pill. That's a different medication. Like. It's, that's two different meds rather than a generic version of the same exact drug. It's like ibuprofen, you know, like we get, if you get a, a pack that's Nurofen branded and it has 200 milligrams of ibuprofen versus you get the, the box that's generic and it has exactly 200 milligrams. They, they are the identical thing. The only thing that's going to be different is the shape, maybe the color and what the binders and fillers and the other ingredients are. The actual medication is absolutely identical between branded and generic. 
hormonal and non-hormonal, that's two different meds. That's not, they're not even comparable. It's like, yeah, chalk and cheese. Uh, conversely, some people can be allergic to the fluffy conventional brand and not to the generic stuff. Yep, absolutely. Yep. Which is not, it's not funny, but it's, it's kind of, you know, a little ironic maybe. Uh, every month has me happy and registered for CTG. Box still shows ridiculous cost. One med that fillers matter, doesn't matter what brand, you just have to stick to the same brand. Yeah. Yep. And I mean, like your doctor will, your doctor and your pharmacist will be able to help you make those kind of decisions as well. That's, you know, they're professionals is what they're there for. Hmm, so I took from doctor that spent 20 years researching placebo. Very documentable, have no idea why it works, but absolutely does. Yeah, isn't it bonkers? Absolutely bonkers. Sorry, Tabra. Yep, all good quiz. I just wanted to make sure, because when it comes to medicine and, like, all your medical stuff, like, medicine names, I don't want to assume that it was a typo. I want to I want to confirm, because, it, like, you never bloody know. So, <laughs> but thanks for that. I show 13th. Indeed. Uh, dog's medication has to be on for the last many months. Both of a sure man, not a fun cost. Pay a guy in dark alley to be my doctor. Yeah, prob's not advisable. Prob's not advisable. Don't try a placebo with a dog. No. Wouldn't do that. Uh, so way more animal meds. Wish there was Medicare for fur kids. I know there's pet insurance, but I'm not sure if that covers medication. Because, like, pet insurance, health insurance, like, it's, you know. But I think it only kind of costs, it covers, like, big surgeries and oopsies and things like that. Mm, save hundreds a year though. I don't pay to see my doctor. It's bulk build. Like, <laughs> I don't remember my pre existing conditions. Gotcha. So you need to kind of get it when they're a teeny tiny, like, baby before anything exists. Which, yeah. It's like uh, health insurance doesn't cover pre-existing conditions for like a waiting period at least. Some of them just, I mean, I don't think they can outright, in Australia, I don't think they're allowed to not anymore, like not cover them at all, but there's a, a longer waiting period for like existing stuff. I know that much. Um, but yeah, I mean, it makes sense. Like you sign up, pay your hundred bucks for the month and then immediately cash out $3,000 worth of surgery to, to fix a pre-existing, it's stupid. Like, no, they're not, like, that doesn't, no, it doesn't work like that. It doesn't work like that. Uh, 14, 50 a month, do you feel grateful not to be American? 1400 sounds like bankruptcy territory. Uh, last time I picked up my meds, I had a conversation with my pharmacist about how my particular medication goes for two grand on the American black market. Thank you. Boop. Boob! Yum! Fried rice. Leftovers. Have you tried it yet? Yes. Is it good? Yes. Uh, hot. Yes. Mmm. Mm. It's a Melbourne sound of home. Yeah, it smells good. It, smell, uh, it smells good. I mean, it does smell good, but it also tastes good. What's up? Yeah, good. Mmm. I was just making okay. sure it tasted good. Yeah, damn straight it does. But yeah, um, because my my particular med goes for like five or six grand in the US. But we can get it for 45. There's a huge black market for it with people like buying it and then sending it overseas. Because the Americans would save, you know, three, four thousand dollars. And we put nearly two grand in our pocket. Everybody wins, except you know it's illegal. Also, it has to be refrigerated. So I'm guessing that when it gets there, it's like lost some of its potency and stuff, but people are still willing to pay that much, so that's ridiculous. That's fucked. message forever and honestly it's still cheaper to pay the meds unless it's chemotherapy yeah honestly i probably i, I wouldn't even pay for chemotherapy for myself <laughs> to be, like if i had to pay and it wasn't covered by like medicare and stuff like good lord
like the quality of life you would have with, you know, being hundreds of thousands of dollars in debt would just be trash. Like, it's not worth it. As a human. Like, I'm not talking about pet stuff. Um. Yeah, I can imagine. Food indeed! I trust being a true chef never serves something you haven't tasted yourself. Look, I mean, he does regularly serve me stuff that he hasn't tasted, but he also hangs out to, like, check that he's, like, cooked the meat properly. Like, he'll, he'll ask me to cut into the meat so he can see how well he's done and all that kind of stuff. Like, he's still conscientious, but he's, he's, yeah. But we had a, um, we had a three pack of, like, pork fillets last night. So we had one each. And the third one had already been frozen, so we couldn't refreeze it. At least I think that's the thing. Um, so he cooked all three of them and popped it in the fridge with some leftover rice from when he, because he made too much rice for, um, for lunches. And I said, well, why don't you just put, why don't you just chop up the chop up the pork and toss it in with the rice and we've got some eggs from when I made cookies and like we've got everything we need for fried rice why don't we just do fried rice for a dinner and he's like ooh so here we go here we go validation received just may now leave <laughs> yeah he's gonna do bubble tea because he's a fan of from my own pharmacy actually pays the full price and get the money from PBS to purchase it correct yeah um that is something, yeah, if you are a person who is on something quite expensive in terms of medication, like, be good. Like, talk to your pharmacist, stay in contact with them, because it can literally, like, it can put them out of business if your medication is that expensive and then you just don't pick it up and then they don't get paid for it and then it goes bad or they can't send it back or, you know what I mean? Like, it's absolutely stay in contact with them and, and let them know, like, you know, order, communicate with them. It's really easy. Like, I'm due to have my medication on this day. So I'm probably going to come in and pick it up around. Like, if I'm going to do it on Saturday, I'm probably going to come pick it up somewhere between, like, Wednesday and Friday. So if you want to order it in, like, that Monday, and then I can come collect it so that you can get your money back and stuff. Like, it's really, really easy to have that kind of a conversation with your pharmacist. And it will, good Lord, <laughs> they really appreciate when you do. Holy cow. I've never been thanked so much buy someone trying to sell me something like good lord it, it really makes a difference <laughs> overheads are insane for pharmacists yeah and another fun fact so the pharmacy makes commission obviously on say selling medication but <laughs> They make the exact same amount of money selling a pack of ibuprofen as they do selling me my $1,400 meds. The way that, like, what I pay and then what the government pays them and what they've paid for it, blah, 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 all the math works out to they make exactly the same amount of money on every prescription. Every prescription. <laughs> And I guess that that helps encourage them to offer the best medication for, for each appropriate case, rather than, you know, them being tempted to offer the higher commission product or whatever. Every single thing that they sell in terms of, like, prescription meds, they make the exact same amount of money on every script. In Australia, I don't know about anywhere else, but this is, I'm talking specifically about my experience with my pharmacist. So it may be specific to Queensland only, for all, all I know. Um, but I'm pretty sure that kind of stuff is Australia-wide. Excuse me. Uh, a friend of mine would sell his ADHD medicine Ritalin to students because it's a study drug. Yeah, that's that's hella abuse. I would never, ever condone doing that. Like, yeah, it's also drug dealing. Pretty sure that's illegal. Hmm. Hey, Jackie. I'm doing all right. I have a headache, but uh, apart from that, I'm doing well. How are you going? Are there any food that Jas likes that you don't that he cooks anyway? Other way around. 
or that I like that he doesn't, that he makes for me anyway? I don't think so. I don't think so. Um... We've got pretty similar tastes, and, um, like, there are, um, there are some habits that Jas has in terms of eating, and there are some habits that I have and stuff, and we just sort of, like, we talk about it, and we accommodate each other. Like, it's, it's, yeah, I don't think so. We're both pretty... Neither of us are picky. Neither of us are picky eaters at all. Um, like, I don't like coriander or capsicum, and neither just jazz. So, so, like, beyond that, there isn't really much, I don't think. But, hmm. I don't think it's just, I just don't think it's a, an issue that's come up. It's interesting to think about. Um, Michael orders one of my once a month like that. Yeah. Yeah. Um, but he doesn't eat, but cooks anyway. Yeah, no, I don't think so. Ah! Den, thank you so much for the resub! Nearly a year indeed, my god, 11 months, holy cow! Oh, thank you so much for the kind words, much appreciated! Much appreciated. Um... Guess a big company like Chemist Warehouse does it differently. That sounds odd. Uh, I don't know how it works for them. Uh, it'd be the same as anywhere else, no, no, they're still a pharmacy. Just because they're a chain doesn't make it any different. Like, they still- if- if it's, like, legal stuff and it's, you know, the PBS, the government scheme and everything, it'd apply the exact same way to every single pharmacy, no matter how big or small and no matter how franchised or anything. Congratulations on your group, Shiva. Well done. Now go get that mount. God damn it, this always- Goes away soon. Me too. Me too. Oh, I went into Bloom's Brand Pharmacy. They never talked to me about any meds. Did well, I don't know what that means? Um. Do you alright? Awesome. Three thousand one hundred sixty-seven fucking gas. But you did it. But you did it. Really like a redlands basically speed. Also, caveat he was supposed to take it, but he opted not to. Like a buffoon. Yeah. Look. Um. Yeah, I'm, yeah. <laughs> Don't do that. Uh, do my food separately, not mixed up. Fair enough. Okay. Dose of vitamin, control drugs, super worse. Yep. Indeed. Use coriander and crabs comes up. Correct. Correct. Okay. <laughs> You can date a different drugs. Yes, they are. They even have different names, Nano. Sorry, I don't know where that's come from. Where where has that statement come from? Um, got Shiba indeed. Yeah, same makes the inferior. So they were the same. Uh, right. So using the chemical name for Ritalin. It probably would have made more sense if you'd said Ritalin is actually this one rather than not. But yeah. Um, the achieve sound popped because of rarity. I was like, what well, fucking achieve? Could I have gotten it to me a solid couple seconds to register what happened? Love that for you. Love that. Good case. Okay, well done, Jackie. Congratulations. Thank you very much, Den and Nano, for your contributions to the TikTok A Tale for Two challenge. If you haven't already, uh, if you haven't already contributed your embers this stream, you can do two thousand. Up to two thousand embers each stream. We got to hit fifty percent today to stay on track to be able to meet it by the end of the week, and we're at forty-three. Oh, we're so close. We're getting there. Thank you very much, Jackie for your contribution also. You can contribute by clicking the little purple campfire underneath the chat box. The sun well. Ah, Chibi! Thank you so much for the resub! Oh, holy shit, we've got a minute 20 to trigger a hype train if anyone wants to steal the uh, badge. It's been good from vaults. Thank you for the well wishes, Chibi. I hope you do as well. 
But yes, if you'd like to contribute to the TikTok A Tale for Two challenge, uh, you can click the uh, purple campfire underneath the chat box and then click the banner and contribute there up to 2,000 every stream. If you don't have 2,000 yet, you contribute. You can contribute lower than that. And then as you earn more, you can keep contributing in more and more chunks until you get to the cap of 2,000 per stream per day. Um, a, ta a TikTok A Tale for Two is a puzzle game on Steam where it's two player and each player, aka Fear and Jazz, only gets half the puzzle. And we have to work together and communicate to f figure out how to solve each of the puzzles. So that's really funky. So if you want to see us get frustrated and like totally fail, or on the other hand, maybe demonstrate our amazing, incredible teamwork, that is what to do. Ah, Chibi! 1500 biddies, oh my God. Thank you so much for the cheer. Much appreciated. Much appreciated. So generous of you. Mmm. You really tasty. Mmm, frustrating fail it is. <laughs> when I have a vision of you getting annoyed and shouting at Jass a lot. Look, I think shouting is probably not quite accurate. I'd say sternly talking, maybe. Honestly, though, there are- Ah! Chibi with the gift and some! Oh my god, thank you so much! You're being so generous today, thank you! My goodness. Um... The, uh, what's it? Yeah, we actually work really well together a lot of the time, but, uh... I don't think we've ever actually done a puzzle game together. So... We'll see. We'll see if the teamwork applies here as well. I'm glad we have a system here that we contribute through our working life. Do we need it or not? And is there and free to the point of delivery the Welsh where the ones that started what our health system is now here? I see what the US has and like we have our beloved HNS here. Hmm. Yeah, look, um it it really is like having a public healthcare system, like universal healthcare, is just it's a game changer. Not only like for the health and longevity of your population and stuff, but for morale, for mental health. Like, you know, having this, this fear of getting sick because you can't afford to treat yourself. Like you can't, you can't afford to be treated, but then you're also forced to put yourself out there in circumstances every day where you could pick something up that you can't afford to be treated for. Like, it's just... I can't imagine how terrifying that must be on a daily basis. Good lord. I'm very thankful that I wound up being born in Australia. Hmm. There's shit that goes wrong in every country, like, honestly, but, like, every country has their problems. And that doesn't, and like, that includes Australia. We, we have some problems, we have some issues, but when it comes down to it, we, we really are quite a lucky country. Like, there's, there is a lot to be thankful for here. And I recognize that a lot of that is because of my privilege of, you know, being middle class or whatever I am and, and being white and cisgender and all that kind of stuff. Like, I, I get that. Um, but I am, I'm definitely still thankful for that. Mental health decisions, if you couldn't afford any help, yeah. You'd either get through it or you wouldn't. That's literally, those are your decisions. It's, well, it's not really a decision, it's, a, it's an outcome, you know? Either you get through it or you don't. That's it. <clears throat> but I mean, even even here in Australia, where we have access to like mental health care plans and all this kind of stuff, there are still people 
who choose like, no, I'm not going to do that bullshit. And they still make the choice to just try to push through it and then, you know, try to make it on their own and then don't like, so having that, like, but that's, the, that's their choice to not pursue the, the help that's available to them. So not having that choice. Yeah. You just, good morning, Spa. Doing very well. Thank you. How are you? Bit of a headache, but I'll survive. I wish I could afford a private hospital last year. Yeah, there's probably for option to rely on. It's just not as good. What do you mean by good in quotation marks? Feeling a lot better now. Nearly over the flu. Fantastic. Awesome spot. Tapping it out. Much rather spend 10k on fishies than fish. Fair. Fair. Unfortunately, this one's bot. I can't. I have to fish it up. <laughs> That's a game. I've made my choice. Okay, but maybe not best. Okay. Fair enough. We did a win. Oh, I got a skin! Amazing. Zam, Benko, and Bod, congratulations to all of you on your bonus shit. Well done. Fia got a skin. I only need one more now. Oh, no, wait. Yeah, I need one more. The Bounty Hunter Mage. That's exciting. Who else got a skin? <clears throat> Who else got a skin? Should we get my jelly lol at 2k casts? Shiba just got his. Um, 3,167? I want to say. Don't know if that's correct, but I'm sure I'll be corrected shortly. Love how it says the untamable and the hydro. We've had them three expansions now. Oh dear. You did indeed deserve, but yes, success. about I'm guessing 5k for me oof well best of luck yeah stick with it I know you got this I know you got this Six, seven. I got the number right. Go me. I told you my I, I speak numbers better than I speak English, and apparently that goes for my memory too. <sighs> Take my I can. I'm just about to start having this stuff. Uh, I'm not sure who that was aimed at, but if anyone wants to tag along with Sheba for the kill of Huracan, let us know. Hey, 
here, Cookie. How you doing? That rice was really damn tasty. Like, really tasty. I, yes, I've destroyed it. It's gone. I've eaten all of it. I'm doing the fair. I just woke up. Um, so today is a Dark Moon first stream. I'm trying to do completionist stuff. Trying to trying to cross things off the list. I've done that already. I've cro I we crossed off a good chunk of achievements. I've got all the achievements for the dancing daily now, which is done. Um, and then I did the battle pets, but I didn't get what I I didn't get what I needed from the um thing. Oh no, actually I think I did. I think the only thing I can get from those is just the prize tickets. So I think I did get I I did get tickets. So that's good. Uh, and then the next thing on the list is fishing, and this is the Dark Moon fishing cap. It has a 1 in 200, 2,500 drop rate. 1 in 2,500. So it's like the goop, except worse. Almost twice as worse. So that's what I'm doing because I'm that kind of person. Okay, there we are there now. Brilliant, Ellie. Let me just see if I have my tune name here. Get the stuff needed. Brilliant, Shiva. Thank you so much for that. The other option is you can also open up like a custom group, and if you put like Shiva in there, and people can find you that way, it might be easier than getting a bunch of whispers and inviting people and stuff. Just from personal experience. <laughs> oh, leveling a rogue for the first time. Brilliant. Are you enjoying it, Cookie? Uh, what did you need for pets out of DMF? Uh, well, it's the two battle pet. There's there's the two daily quests. The pet battle. I think they're dailies. Um, but they drop Dark Moon tickets, and I need more Dark Moon tickets. Uh, I'm trying to I'm trying to aim for the Dark Moon dirigible or whatever, you, however you pronounce it. On fair, it's a thousand tickets. I have fifty four. So I'm a bit off. We'll get there though. Good point. Yeah, look, I six years of streaming has to have taught me something, right? Six years of trying to put goddamn fucking groups together has to have taught me something. I see you like torturing yourself too. Oh, absolutely. I I am very stubborn. See, this good is two of the pets. I believe I both have. I I think I have both of those because they're not coming up here like it just has the dark moon prize ticket as what can be contained inside so i think that's because i've already got the pets um. there you go i've got sid the squid and i've got the dark moon eye as well so yes i have both of those already Yay! I like having things. <clears throat> How many unique pets do you have? Uh, 1281. What duplicates do I have? I shouldn't have any. Well, I should have one. Oh. Why? Interesting. And then the sunflower I hold on to because that's a uh, PPP strategy with two of those. There we go. But yeah, 1281. Not too bad. Not great, but not too bad. Actually, we're in the US servers. Oceanic as well. Our servers are in Sydney. Uh, I think it's. Uh, just got last pet from 90 last week. Six and six most past 15 worldwide. Well done. Well done, Chibi. Uh, yeah, we've got a pet battle stream coming up at some point, don't we? Yes, because it's next month. Because we unlocked the uh, last week's challenge was a pet battle stream. And you guys completed it. So that'll be next month. Um, I'll be collecting as many as I can from all over the world. 
<clears throat> Gotta love that, uh, data for Azeroth listing. This is I have 1283. Ah, uh, that might be... 1283 might be because it's um, Alliance ones as well. That would make sense. Collection, average person who have Oh no no, I'm quite happy with my collection. I just also want more. <laughs> I'm I'm happy, but that doesn't stop me from uh, from pushing, if that makes sense. <laughs> All right, yeah. Mm -hmm. Want to need more as well? Yep. Yeah. Yep. That's okay. Ah, uh, nearly 300 attempts so far. Yay. So I've got 212 pets still to collect, according to DFA, but there's a bunch, obviously, that are no longer obtainable. That's okay. Awesome! Fantastic. Yeah. There's, um... I got my hair dye today. That was good. I had to... Dye hair came up on my to-do list. I was like, well, shit. <laughs> so I uh, went and bought a couple bottles and they arrived today, which is good. So... Many deliveries for the fear. Six from China, no I can get. Two from Taiwan, yeah. Yep, and then ones that were from, like, promotions that have been discontinued and stuff. That's okay. It is what it is. And all the protoform synthesis ones, good lord, that's going to take me a little while. Makes me so sad. Yeah. Yeah. Jamie I call it it hurts. Yeah. Yep. Oh, oh, I need a bubble tea. No, you don't. Yeah, I do. It's um it's lemon juice. It's wet. Thank you for the bubble tea. I see you finished dinner. It I must have. have been really, really tasty. It was really, really tasty. Barely ever finished dinner that fast. <laughs> oh, I, sh I shoveled it in. It was delicious. Excellent. Oh, you can thank you. I am doing a dishwasher. I know, but like, like I may as well take the dish to stick it in the dishwasher. A glass of 
There's a way. Wait, 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 wait. I don't have space for this. Probably. Maybe. I don't know. That doesn't go in your dishwasher. No, but it does go in the kitchen. But it doesn't go in your dishwasher. <laughs> I'm only doing a dishwasher. <laughs> I'm hilarious. Thank you so much. I could put it in the dishwasher. No, you can't. It says literally printed on the bottle. Never put in dishwasher. Warning. To prevent personal injury, never wash in the dishwasher. It actually says never. Never. Like, actually never. Never wash in Yeah. Or with hot water over 50 degrees Celsius, or place in a freezer. Yep. It degrades the plastic, and so when they when it pressurizes with the bubbles on the soda stream, it'll go bang and kill you. Mm. Shards of plastic. No! We have been over this. I need your help to... I need your help to pay rent. No dying. Moist hands. <laughs> of course, I sweat its chest. Let's also liberate the cool glass of turnip juice. Just curious, who is that? Jast. That's Jastereth. Head moderator. Also, my best mate. It's about a flesh wound. Yep, he's. Look. Flesh wound means he can't go to work and then he can't pay rent, so. Keep him away from forklifts. Yeah, unfortunately, that's part of his job. Cooks dinner and cleans. Do you play your slave? He's not a slave, Quiz. He's a housemate. He's an adult human who helps contribute to, like, housework and shit. Which is what I do too. I also cook dinner and I also clean. Just not while I'm on camera. <laughs> not while I'm at work. Uh, let's test that theory. The memorial will be next week. No. No testing that theory. At all. Also, I've hit 300. Yesterday, you gotta love Monty Python in Dave. Absolutely. Mm. Bubble Tea Club. Strawberry milk tea with tapioca pearls. Much recommend. There are so many pets that I'm missing that drop off bosses in Torghast. Good lord. <clears throat> so excited for Saturday. Skip me to clear. I want to struggle to do. Oh. Awesome, Den. Fantastic news. Those kind of days are so awesome, hey? They're exhausting. By the end of it, you're just dead. But, like, oh, it's so worth it. So worth it. Run out of it. Mm. Mm -hmm. Good call, good call.
Oh, taking bets. How many casts this is going to take me? <laughs> is this a new hat that you're trying to fish up? Yes. The Dark Moon Fishing Cap. One in 2,500 drop chance. Six billion. Look, why? I'm just trying to get the alien room for Stranglethorn and people do that in like five minutes. Yeah, the Stranglethorn is really easy to do. Like, so Stranglethorn, because everything's cross server now, the first 25 get prizes. So once you see it trigger, don't like keep going until it says all prizes have been claimed, blah, 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 blah. It actually, it takes a lot longer than you might think. Um, the first time I actually made a solid attempt and was there when it started and blah, blah, blah I won the very first time. Um, <clears throat> like I, I was in the top 25 kind of thing. Set your hearthstone to Booty Bay is the biggest thing I can give you. Set your hearthstone to Booty Bay. Um, go out and find a spot to sit where there aren't too many other people. And then when the announce goes off, you know, obviously start fishing and then um, hit that hit that um, hearthstone as soon as you've got the number you need. One thousand one hundred and sixty two, you reckon, Ali? God, I hope not. Probably more than two. Well, it has already been more than two. We've had 324 so far. 325. <laughs> God, this was done. Yeah. This is this is why when you're trying to do something that you know is difficult, you always, 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 always read all the way I had comments. Check everything. Like read all the stuff and make sure you know exactly what's going on. Because the information's out there. You just have to you gotta find it. My bad pet parent for laughing when my pup falls at his face and my hair has long legs and huge feet. Yeah. No, not at all. People laugh at like toddlers and shit. It's the same thing, right? Back to work. Enjoy, Kaz. Hope it treats you well. We'll see you soon. We'll see you soon. I feel like I'm gonna be doing something else while I'm fishing to entertain y'all. Like I just I don't know what though. Is there like a is there a is there a weak aura that'll give us like a crossword puzzle or something? Server as well. Yeah, that's why they upped it to 25. But the vast majority of people who wanted something from it have done it, and they no longer participate. So fishing level in this tune max. I know there are comments on Wowhead from like 
patch 5.2 talking about I think it's bugged for characters at max fishing blah 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 I, I don't think that that's the case I know Yori I know how are you going I hope you're well Little did I know when I set up a Dark Moon Fair stream that I would spend most of it bloody fishing. Oh, excuse me. Naki, I must not sleep yet. Oh, okay. How come? I mean, like, 7.30 is a reasonable time. I much feel of fishing. Slave to fishing. It seems one day I will have everything from fishing and I will no longer ever have to fish until the next expansion's released. Ah, uh, too much sleep. It'll fuck me over tomorrow. Ah, uh, okay. Fair enough. Or you'll just wake up really early tomorrow. <clears throat> Question, is anyone else having issues with Data for Azeroth where it, you, they're going to update a character and it's saying character not found? Uh, so Shiva has said in an announcement in case people are alt tabbed and stuff, if you want a chance at the Hiracon, Hiracon mount, you must be Horde and NA. Search Hiracon hyphen Shiba on custom group finder. Note that Shiba has two eyes. But you could probably just type in Hiru and see all the groups that come up and then find Shibas. Shiba did get the group. Yas. You sad life. Aww. That's okay. We have we actually do have quite a large EU community here. Um mostly in Discord and stuff. Um, but people do tend to hang out in chat who are like from EU and stuff too. Fish, fish, and sheep and horde. Brilliant. Have fun. Best of luck. Uh, occasionally, not too fair. Once I refresh it, usually sorts itself out. Interesting. Because I mean, I'm it's going through and refreshing my fifty characters, but it's so far it can't find three of them. That's unusual. Like, it can't find one of my mages, it can't find one of my warriors. Oh, it can't find another one of my mages. And it can't find fear. Like, three mages and a warrior. Can't find them. And it's also skipping over, like when I did uh, update all, it's skipping over a couple in the list. And just not bothering to update them, which is also kind of strange. I guess the website's just a bit balked or something at the moment. Chibi as well. Thank you, Chibi. It's a bit odd. Yeah, it is a bit strange, hey? Hates mages? Yeah, look. It did, it did successfully. Oh no, it skipped over my, my Fiamma on Alliance side, so... Yeah, look. I don't know. I don't know. What are you fishing for? Dark Moon Fishing Cap. It's a hat that is literally a fish. Uh, it's got a 1 in 2,500 drop chance. And it's the next thing on my list of Dark Moon Island stuff to get done. Yeah. Oh, and it just didn't find another mage. So that's out of my five mages, four of them are character not found, and one of them got skipped over. Oh, and then it just didn't find a druid. Maybe they're updating the armory or something. Maybe the API is getting some maintenance. Will you take a break from fishing from the hat? Why would I take a break? Something else on the achievement list. Oh, it's not an achievement list. It's like a collectibles list. But, um, nah, I think I'm good. I, I want it, like, it'll be nice to cross this off and then never have to do it again. Yeah, I mean, support her correct. Good lord. 
That's, yep. <laughs> oh dear, Spot. Oh dear. The hat will still be on the list to collect. Exactly. Exactly. There we go. When I manually looked for the druid, it found the character. So I think it's just the API updating and I'm just happening to hit it at um, inopportune moments. Wouldn't that be horrible looking at the DFA listing when fear is not included? All the stuff that's earned on fear doesn't count towards anything else. God, that'd suck. Plenty fish to sell later on. Oh, absolutely. And apparently they're on the auction house on my server at the moment for 18 gold a pop or 19 gold a pop. And I've got 274 plus all of those sharks. So I reckon I'm going to have some... Uh, so maybe some golds. Maybe some golds. You think of when I bought them? Yeah. Ah, oh dear. Um, I have the Tide Caller. It doesn't have Jaina in the name, I don't think. I do have the Tide Caller, and I've got the Brutusaur, yeah. Hmm. Oh, skin AZM! Fantastic! So did I. Congratulations! That's wonderful news. Yeah, one of these, one of the mages is having some real issues. It keeps coming back as character not found. This is kind of concerning. for me. Nah. Never impossible. When they announced that it was being removed, it was like eight months prior to them actually doing it or something. There's plenty of time for anyone to make some solid gold. You just had to, like, actually make it a, like, a task that you did. Um, <clears throat> definitely not impossible. Uh, I did it by farming raids for raw gold. Like vendoring the the stuff that dropped and using the gold, and by doing garrison gold making. Eventually, the money, the gold I was making from the garrisons, massively outweighed the gold I was getting from the raid farms. Like slowly but steadily, it kind of overtook it. And then once it overtook it, I stopped doing the raid farms, uh, and I bought it a couple months before it got removed. Well, removed, so moved to the Beamer. Spam, Ben, Draz, Apro, Silver, and Bod. Congratulations to all of you on your bonus shit. Um, my kind of feeling was it's going to be a whole lot easier for me to farm, like for me to focus and farm 5 million gold in six to eight months than it's going to be for me to farm 10 million gold with no deadline. Um, I, I operate much better when I have a deadline. So that's what I did. And it worked. And I bought it. I was very happy. Uh, and then after that, I bought the Bloodfang Widow for two million. Uh, I bought a couple of mounts that were half a million each. Um, I bought the three frogs that are a third of a million each. Um, so yeah, I've, I've spent a fair bit on um, on mounts since then because once I once I'd saved up the five mil and then dropped it, I, I kind of realized I've done it once. I can do it again. Like I can make this gold back. Why? Why am I holding on to it? I might as well grind up to this point and then spend it and buy buy the stuff. Um, so I did. It worked. Ah. 
Uh, I wish they didn't know a lot of it since being new. A lot of what you said with garrison things. Whoosh. Uh, exclamation garrisons will get you a guide to how to do it. Nice and easy. That's good job. Thank you. Thank you. But yeah, um, uh, what's it? There's, there's still absolutely... Like, you can definitely still buy a Bruto. It's a lot more difficult now, obviously. Um, but if you can grind up to 10 million gold, which is, is very doable for literally anybody, grind up to 10 million. Takes effort, obviously. If you want a reward, you need to put in the effort. Uh, but yeah, grind up the 10 mil and then check the black market auction house every day. Like clockwork. And when it pops up, drop your bid. So thank you, Chibi. Yeah, it's it's not easy, but it's also not div it's not complex. It just takes time. I've been I've put gold making on the massively on the back burner for like the last month and a half or so, um, just because I've had so much other life stuff been going on and I've been trying to catch up on things and all that, and so I've just sort of bugger it. You know, gold and WoW is not as important to me right now. I've got nearly a million on Alliance side and I've got three million on Horde. That's enough for now. Um, I'll get the rest of my life back in order uh, and then I'll start farming it again. Mm, you're saving me with knowledge again. That's what we do. That's what I do. But yeah, that, that guide is from Drizzling Rose. She's a really lovely human panda hybrid person. She's Look, she's just really, really lovely. Um, but yeah, I, I don't want you to think that that's my guide or anything. I, I have a link to it because that's what I used. Um, and so when people say, how do you make gold from your garrison? This is how I use Drizzling Rose's guide. So yeah, she's, uh, she did, she was streaming. I'm not sure if she, I haven't seen her live for a while, but um, it might just be because she's streaming at times that I'm asleep or something. But, um, yeah, she's pretty awesome. She needs so much work and effort as one willing to put forth to reach one's goals. Correct. Correct. Um, there is also like an ability thing to it as well. Like, um, you know, there are a lot, a lot of people. Like, it's easy. You just got to sell carries. Sure, but not everyone is capable of carrying. Not everybody is capable of doing a fifteen, let alone carrying other people through a fifteen. Um, so some things do require a certain level of types of skills. Uh, and yes, you can put in the time and effort to learn and develop that skill. That's great. Or you can put in the time and effort to develop a different skill, like like building up the garrisons and stuff like that. It, it really just kind of depends. The garrisons, it's it's a slow burn. Um, it's consistent as hell because the vast majority of gold that you're making is from vendoring stuff. Um, like it's not, you're not relying on there to be a market from other players or anything like that. It's literally just you vendor stuff. Um, so it's very, very consistent. Um, it's very low risk again with the vendoring, very, very low risk, but the reward is a little lower as well. Like you're not, you're not going to get 50 K, 60 K, hundred K in a week. It's not how it's like, that's not how it works. Um, so like it, it takes time, but all it needs is like logging in once a week or, or if you're if you're wanting to you know double your income once a day on each tune to do your, your daily cooldown um but that doesn't you like literally log in hit the daily cooldown button log off log into the next tune daily cooldown button log off it's like yeah so yeah it's um i definitely recommend having a look into it Uh, you guys are very, very welcome, Venti. Not a worry. What do I need to sacrifice for all this knowledge or sell my soul to the evil? <laughs> no, not at all. You just read the guide. You're good. I'm stream for a while. Yeah, I'd say life's gotten busy or something. So I'm sure it was in the fine print. Oh my god. Uh, next match, you're gonna have housing. No, if we were gonna have housing, we would have had it like years ago. But that's whatever. I guess we'll benefit Mount Get. Congrats, Shiba. Well done. Much my raid team was in there. Brilliant. Ah, oh, bug bug appearance. Yay. Fantastic. Mm, appearances are now dropping from res. Well, that's cool. Mm. 
in chests. Oh, there were there were a handful that were dropping from chests all the time anyway. Um lots of family there. Awesome. Um, but yeah, uh there are there are a handful of permanent chests that drop Pocket Pock appearances guaranteed. Um But uh I'm not sure about the rares. I hadn't looked into that one. Ventu, go check the chat rules for me. You click the little cog underneath the chat box and then click view chat rules or view channel rules or something. Have a look at the first rule for me. In the next 10 years. Yeah, that's what I thought too, Shiba, and then this popped up on my to-do list. Customize body. Ah, gotcha, gotcha. Hmm. I maybe I, I think I don't think I've unlocked that particular part of the um the what's it in the cave yet because I didn't think it was that important. So yeah. Oh, that's probably what happened there. Mm, that's not what I said, Ventu. There's a cog underneath the chat box, the settings thing. If you click that, there's a button that says view chat rules. That's the one you need to look at. There's no command for it, it's just underneath the chat box. So I kill you multiple times a day, so it guaranteed mount if you get the lure after. There we go. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did that as well. Now that I think about it. Oh. Thanks, Ventu. I don't know, pimp my pocket pock features. <laughs> pimp my pocket pock. Oh no. Oh no. Might have said why before, might have missed it. Why are you going up to do my fishing cap? Do not see an achieve for it. Do not see it as mugs on my rogue. Um, it's because it's an all the things stream. We're doing a Dark Moon Island, a Dark Moon Fair stream today. It was a challenge last month. It got met. And so I'm spending a day trying to complete as much stuff on Dark Moon, uh, in Dark Moon Fair as I can. Uh, and this is my ATT window for it. And the first thing there that I haven't done yet is the fishing cap. So that's what I'm doing. Correct. No spoilers. This is a spoiler free zone. And because leaks could be true or they could be false. If they're false, it doesn't fucking matter anyway. But if they're true, then that's a spoiler. So we do not discuss leaks here and we do not discuss spoilers. The general rule of thumb is if it hasn't happened on stream, it hasn't happened. So when we do storylines, you know, when they release a new chunk of storyline on a Wednesday, that kind of thing, if I haven't done it on the stream, if it hasn't happened yet, you don't talk about it because it's as if it hasn't happened. Because if people spoil me, they get banned. Mm, yeah, basically, like I, I'm, I'm trying to up my completion percentage, and this is how I'm gonna do it <laughs> with a hat. <laughs> with a hat. Hmm. Uh, did anyone get the map makeup? Yes. Uh, I think it was Shiva. I think it was Shiva. Um, it's the Amber Primordial Diamond. Yeah, and then continue fishing. Yes, but you can do it. You can do it. Eventually, when it drops. Yep. Yep. Of course, it was Shiva. Look, it's not always Shiva. It's not always Shiva. 
Just is a lot of the time. It looks like there's a lot of data for Azeroth's, uh, Azeroth's stuff that's balked. Because it's saying I'm fourth on Saurfang for completion score, but when I click it, it has me in third place by like 4,000 points kind of thing. So I think, I think maybe they're doing something in the back end. Maybe something's, uh, yeah. Let's see, the Twitter pick, ah. Purple? Wait, there's no purple on the Amber Primordial Dialhorn. Oh, it's a wishy bum. Oh dear. Do, 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 do. Oh, by the way, we, we passed baby 400 two, casts. Da, 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 baby two, na, 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 na. So, gee, uh, okay. Is it purple? Oh, yeah, that looks like grey to me. Maybe it's just my PC settings. But yeah, the um it was the the green swirly bits and then like the whole body being like yellowy and stuff, uh like yellow but dusty and dirty and, and darker and greyish kinda. That's like the the old gold sort of stuff, and then the little pop of mustard um was the the chair. Yeah. So cool. Oh, thank you, Ali. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. Has everyone contributed to the uh, to the uh, stream challenge today? We're at forty-seven percent. Got to get to fifty percent today to be on track to finish it by the end of the week. Excuse me. Just good for your favorite items. I don't know, maybe I consider it a personal favorite to donate an Emmy and visit all for this goal. Ali was the one who suggested this goal, FYI. I'm pretty sure that was you. Like, like, pretty sure that was you. Where's my hat? Where's my hat? It's so bad. Oh dear. It's my turn with the hat. Give it back, Shiba. I want it so I can stop fishing. <laughs> Don't you guys want me to stop fishing? Or do you actually like watching me fish for hours on end? An entertaining game to watch. I feel like it will be. I'm like, I'm trying to see, I'm trying to figure out if there's a way I can um, pull Jas's screen through as well without it being like, without it killing my PC with all the rendering and stuff. I don't think I'm going to be able to do it. So you guys will only get my half as well. But yeah. Let's see what other guys you get to suffer too. I already suffered. I did my, my group suffering, Shiba. I did my group suffering. Which one it's annoying you? Fair. Fair. Only 
2,500 is too many. Yeah, that was ridiculous. The pond nettle can, like, go all the way away. I'm chill talk to you during this game plays a plus. Yeah, look. Yeah. Yeah. Being just trying with our range, just trying. Yeah, look, a little bit, just a touch. At least we got good music. Please, are in Jesus. May we have this cap. Allow me to wear a fish on my head and move on to the next part of my thing imaging. He's so confused. Aww. That's cute. Jones right now. <laughs> Hello, Daz. How you going? Welcome back. <laughs> That's super cute, Sam. Four forty nine.
Fifty-two. Of course, this doesn't count the casts that I've had prior, like earlier. <sighs> Excuse me. Where does one farm a demon's deck? Shadowy tarot for inscription. Random card of demons. Okay. That's easier than I thought it'd be. From demons, no, from inscription. That's what I was like, which, what dungeon am I gonna have to farm to do this? It's just inscription. I have a few inscriptionists. I have a few scribes. Just a couple. Oh, excuse me. Light parchment, parchment and fiery ink. Where does fiery ink come from? Ruby pigment. Oh, okay. That's okay. So ruby pigment is fire bloom, purple lotus, Arthur's tears, sungrass, blindweed, ghost mushroom, or grom's blood. Mill them for ruby pigment, make fiery ink, make shadowy tarot, hope for demons guards that are like one set. <laughs> Seems just make it from Mr. Hyde. Um, um, you know what bums me out? When version of a sale on reward seats the day after I buy a reward seat for backstrip. Oh, Ali. Damn. Damn. Yeah, I'm waiting until usually mid to late May for the Jetstar birthday sale. Oh, excuse me. Give me the hat. That's not a hat, that's a fish. Give me the hat. 17%. 468 casts. That's a fish! Give me the hat! <laughs> oh, God, this is gonna... Oh, dear. Uh, one in chat, but she gets the hat before 500. Well, that's 30 casts to go until 500. Fish can be a hat. The hat is a fish. 
Like, literally, it's a fit. Look. That's what it looks like. It's a fucking fish. So gimme. <laughs> that a fish. That is a fish. Correct. Correct. Yay! I love that I pointed at the screen as though you guys could bloody see it. Anyway. <laughs> Hats get! You can't do that right now. Oh, I'm fishing. Shit. Um, here we go. Why is it not ticking off? There we go. Thank you, ATT. Much appreciated. All right, so I'm gonna get all the stuff out of these. It's a hat. I did get the hat. Oh, it's a fish. Yeah, <laughs> fish hat. Fish hat. Ah, really? Let's do this. Ah, well, that was fucking perfect timing, dude. Good lord, because it, it it started playing as the re as the refresh finished. So yeah, that was perfect. Well done. Good job. Oh look, I got a pineapple pizza and another one. And another one. So that hat, um, uh, it, it summons a pool of debris as well. So like, it doesn't just, it increases your fishing skill, but then it also summons a pool that you can fish from. So that's nice. Okay. So I now need to do the dailies. So. Yum, pineapple, indeed. Mail one to Elena. She's on a different server. I don't think I can. But that's funny. Yeah, I don't think she does, unfortunately. Burn that pizza? Never. I think Jess wants some pizza as well. So you can fish if the want arises. Yes. Look, there are there are definitely still things I need to fish up. Unfortunately. So I will absolutely need to do more fishing at some point. Um, just hopefully, look, I did, I did suggest that one of the, um, one of the things we have was a, like one of the goals, community goals we have was a fishing stream. Um, so yeah. Okay. Hammer time. So I'm gonna do I'm gonna do the dailies is the next thing on the list. That's a lot of hoggers.
in my dinner. Oh no, matey. Oh no. Yes! Congratulations to Zam, Chap, Bod, Jar, V, Tri Trig, and Draz on all of your bonus shit. Well done. Congratulations. Boss defeated! Boss defeated. Alright, we're gonna go up top so we can grab the tokens and then the skin. Bubble tea, yes I do. So tasty. Alright, turning that in. Tonk Commander. You got my attention. How are you? Off with you. Run. Oh, we're done. There we have four, three, two, one. Firebirds challenge. I like this one. Welcome, friends. Welcome Five. 
Instagram. Oh, really? That one's a while ago. It's fun though. I really need to get on to like actually coming in every fucking like every month. Because I want to get I want collections done, you know. Racing time. <gasps> hey, we hit fifty percent. How you doing? Yay. <laughs> no, no. God damn it. <laughs> I hit it the wrong angle. Oh, for God's sake. This is fine. Totally fine. It's been a while since I did the uh, speed runs of these. <sighs> they were fun. Like, oh. Having to get it like perfect every time was entertaining. Stop going. Yeah, that's fair. Yo. Let's do something different this time. There we go. The other route, the one that goes the other way when you use the Rocketeer. Oh my god. Throw you up in the air and then you boost to keep it going longer. It's, ah, oh, the air time. I'm pretty sure there's an achievement for staying in the air for X amount of time or something as well. It's good fun.
Well, spit it out. Ages of my brain to incorporate. Fair. Fair. Yeah, I watched, um, I watched so many YouTube videos. Like, this is, this is the kind of situation where YouTube videos really come in handy for, um, Cause like shortcuts like that, you yeah, know. Oh god, I could never get that one right. Oh, it sucks. Why well, I suck, either way. This one. So good. And I had to circle around here because I was too high for it to count. There you go, you were like the wind. There we go. When you got that you were like the wind thing to trigger, that's when you got the achieve. Pretty sure at least. I should have jumped up the hill there, oh well. Just fun. Lucky, how you doing? Welcome back. Do you use pain of a fishing up hat? You got this indeed. Indeed. Recognizing a panel line. Yep. Yep. And bam. What's up? That one doesn't actually the more big racing doesn't give you a thing, does it? No. All right, so. That's all the game, that's all those I can do. Uh, Demon's deck is crafting through inscription. Den Mother's Demise. You gotta get what's her name to spawn. Um, I go stream really well, really well. I haven't like crossed many things off, but I've been productive, so that's nice. Um, do you know how trying to achieve it? Emerald wins, then just gave up. Oh no, oh no. Am I supposed to kill the snarlers to make? I think I am. It used to be massively overpowered. So I'm excited. That's good. I'm so glad to hear it. So what did you kill this time? Yep. Yeah. You got a fishing hat. You got that going for you, which is nice. Yeah, not only is it a fishing hat, it's a literal fish that sits on my noggin. So I'm pretty happy with that.
been playing dread house oh it's the dread house that i can't kill haha <laughs> all right this will be fun Oh, evade bugged. What? Oh, you bastard. It must have feared my my image and chased it off. Good lord. Right, so I can't kill those myself. Brilliant. I don't think they're supposed to be though. I think they're supposed to be like a group thing. That person doesn't seem to be stopping. Anyone want to come summon Moon Moon? <laughs> okay, brilliant. It didn't matter, I guess. It did! It did lucky. It's the Amber Primordial Dire Horn. Thank you so much. So we do cross region. Yeah, we've we've spoken about it at length because we've got so many people from the EU in the community. Um it's one of those things where either, like, given how long it's been and how many people have been asking for it and all that kind of stuff, either they've already looked into it and it's not possible, or they've already looked into it and they're working on it. Like, there's nothing we can do. Seriously, you hang around and then you just piss off. Sure. Oh, you bastard. Why do these leash so short? That is just ridiculous. Um... I don't know, I guess it. That's I've got to get you to eat you joke. Yeah, nah. No, this we looked into in the past back then was said not possible because of the lag, but that saying. Can't be looking into it again, coming to new conclusion. Yeah, absolutely. Especially with the improvements in 
tech we have now and stuff like we have people who live in the eu but who have north american accounts and they play with us just fine so the lag is not a thing anymore like Um, yeah, hello. Most of you them have no. Um, there have been a few, um, uh, politicians of some level in America who have submitted a thing to, um, yeah, that's fine. Do, like, are you not in the same shard, Ali? Um, so, yeah, the, the anti-competition thingamajig. They're still investigating whether or not they're happy for Microsoft to acquire Activision Blizzard. Like, it's not, like, it was never going to be set in stone, um, as soon as they announced it, but it's like, yeah. Hmm. They must be in a raid group, considering that they're the same faction. Oh no, they're not. It's a human warrior. That's interesting. Usually it shows their names as orange. That's really odd. Yeah, and it won't be finalized for years. Like, it, it won't be finalized for years. Even if it, they get approval, then they have to actually go through and actually make the purchase, and it'll take a long time. It'll take a long time, but that's okay. It's, you know, big business. It takes a while. There's a t like a buttload of red tape and stuff to get through. So yeah, I hope they make the right choices for everyone involved. Let's do it. We can, we can hope. Absolutely. Must not be. We are now and that's what matters.
kill the babies. We need to kill the biggins. Then the emote will happen. Oh, I give you my sickness. Huh? Squinch. 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 Where? It must be further south. That or it timed out or something. I don't know if that's a thing that can happen. It's a snarler. That's not the right. Oh, there we go. Chasing my mirror around. <laughs> That's funny. Incoming. Target you. AOE incoming. AOE incoming. <sighs> AOE incoming. I love that I get my apocalypse, my, my Sun King's blessing triggers as it finishes, my combustion comes off cooldown. As combustion finishes up, I get another proc for pyro. Like it's, it's just, 
It's amazing. But then I pull aggro, so that's not ideal. Target you. AOE incoming. Oh, battle. You wanna watch them kill this or you wanna watch the battle? Perfect. Oh, something fun. Uh, I got my yesterday, I got my Fitbit summary for last week. I took more steps than Jas. We've got each other on there as friends and, uh, like, usually, because he works on his feet, you know, he's walking around and all that kind of stuff. But last week, I beat Jas for steps taken. So I was, I was quite impressed with myself for that. Even though I sit down for both my jobs. <laughs> Jas letting himself down? Yeah, apparently. That's okay, I'm sure he had more important things to focus on. Just sip it up, Jas. It makes a shorter meaning you walked further. Correct. Next week, next week when I get my summary email, maybe I should tweet about it. Maybe I should share my results. No, no. The person who's tanking must keep dying or something. Target you. Just walking less than fear. the quest I'm gonna turn this in it wants me to do the master pit fighter stuff but I don't think that's up for a while so I feel like maybe I should ignore that also you know pvp And there's a rogue's deck, which is another inscription thing. Swords deck as well. Can I help you? Off and away. So that's done. Midnight and every three hours are after, so actually, it'll start in 10 minutes. 
I do see that. I'm really cool threat with your awesome flaming power. Look, I was using my cooldowns to try to get it dead faster, so maybe that's what happened. Oh, it looks like there's gonna be a pit fight in like 10 minutes, so I might as well give it a try. Maybe I'll get myself an achievement. <laughs> So how many tickets can you earn a day from DMF? Oh, battle. Cool. Thank you. Oh, I'd end up satisfying my craving for sweets the other day. I did, I made cookies. After stream. Fade, Zem, Rel, Ali, Jar, Bod, and Draz. Congratulations to all of you on your bonus shit. Uh, yeah, I made, I made cookies. <laughs> so that was nice. Da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da-da. <laughs> Okay, let's ask where I heard how many tickets I can get a day. Dark Moon Fair. So 278 tokens each monthly fare. So it would actually take me only four months to get the thing if I was like bang on about it, but I'm not because I've got other shit to do. <laughs> um, so 105 tickets for completing both pet dailies for seven days, 80 tickets for the dungeon and PVP books, 
42 for completing six mini games, seven days. 17 for primary and secondary profession quests. 10 for turning in 250 Grizzly trophies. 10 for doing Den Mother's Demise. And 14 for doing the real race and the real big race for seven days. Pet battle dailies are per account, but everything else is per character. Seems doable. Yeah. So let's ignore the dungeon books and stuff like that. Because if, if I'm going to do this on alts, right? So the six mini games for seven days is 42 tickets. Primary and secondary profession quests. I could do that. So seven, to, uh, no, hang on. Um, 14 for doing the real race and the real big race. So then divide that by seven days. Means you get eight in a day. Plus the 17. It's 25 a day. All right, 25, eight a day, 25 total. If I did one day worth it. And I, you can't buy anything for 25 tickets. Everything's a minimum of 55. God damn. God damn. There's not a whole lot of point to doing these on alts. I mean, yeah, there is because there's stuff that I can't use on fear. But, um... Oof. Yeah, they're all BOE, so... I can send them across to whichever tune. I... As much as it would be faster if I did it on a bunch of tunes, it just... I don't think it's worth it. Dupe with the winning streak? Absolutely. Look at Dupe go. I don't think it's worth it doing this on every single... <laughs> 278 though, that's a lot of the transmog pieces each month. It still it'd still take me a couple of years to get it done if I was just doing it on fear. Trying to get with DMF tickets? Oh oh you know, just everything. <laughs> everything. I want to finish the Dark Moon Fair. I want to cross everything off, and I'm just looking at it and it's actually gonna take me years. But three years from today is still sooner than three years from a month from now. You know? That's what I need to do on alts. Yeah, but it's not really worth doing it on alts. The amount of time it takes you to do all of the bits and bits, like get a character to Thunder Bluff and then to into the portal and everything, like all of the effort that it takes to do all that, you get eight tickets a day. Like, it's not really worth it. It's not really worth it. Before that, new stuff will have been added. It's all about getting more, like, complete more than has been, like, than, than they add each patch. Like, this patch they added 41 new mounts. So I need to get 42 mounts minimum this patch to stay, like, ahead of the, ahead of the new content. Checks out that you can buy all the mounts and pets or whatever else is a portal from all to get there. Is there? Where is it? Oh, like in the portal room. Yeah. I could do that. I've got all my tunes in the garrison because it's where I do gold making. But going through, this is the thing, going through 50, 50 characters to do that every day would literally take me the entire day. I have a day job. I'm streaming, which means, like, I'm, I'm running a business. I've got all of my, um... And honor. Why is this not... triggering? Every th Bouts begin at midnight, and every three hours thereafter. 
Is that midnight wow time rather than our like our time? It is because an hour ago there was one when I was still fishing. Oh, gross. Yeah, okay. So it's it's at four. It's at um one prior. So it's at eleven, two, five, eight, eleven, etc. Okay, that's annoying. Really annoying. Um, the pit, the, the, um, the other concert doesn't start for another half hour. I can do the profession dailies though, the profession quests. My tickets for that. Um, you just do it with your mage alts. Yeah, but like 50 characters getting here every single day to like do all of these quests and stuff it's a that's a big effort like a huge big effort um and i i don't have i'm time poor as it is i don't have the time to commit to doing that it would take literally hours hours and hours every day for a week like <laughs> it's a good thought but um yeah i'm not sure i can I'm not sure I can justify that. <laughs> mm, why do people hate Vashia? Is it the underwater one? Um, if it's the underwater one, it was because it was really difficult to tell where you were in the space that you could see. Like the depth perception with the water was really, really difficult. Um, and like there were things that were like the, the quest markers and stuff didn't work super great. So if something, if you got to something and it was like 12 million stories above or below you, there was no real indicator to tell you that it was up or down because back when that expansion was current, we didn't have like level indicators um, yeah, that's kind of, it was just really, really difficult to navigate. How may I aid you? The clan, I've already done that. Uh, so I have something to do in stream. I spent three hours just doing farm stuff in Panda, yeah. Yep. <laughs> Just one time stuff, but there is a daily event limited to one time per account. Yeah, exactly. So you're not getting, you're not really getting that many tickets anyway. So like doing all that effort for eight tickets per turn is like, yeah, I don't know. Maybe when I've got more time on my hands, ha! But uh, I am, yeah. Unfortunately, so like the, the the number of hours I spend working on stream, like on the back end, doing all my social media and preparing stuff for streams and all that, like all of that stuff, it's it, plus the time I spend live, it's a full time job. Um, like the the hours are the equivalent of a full time job. Um, plus I have a day job. Plus I have a. Uh, place that I live to maintain so like doing housework and, and laundry and cleaning and etc etc like it's just um yeah it's it's difficult it's worth it I think it's worth it I enjoy like I, I I love streaming and I love content creating um I don't so much love the um the back end side of things but it's a necessity so that's okay. It's fine. I just have to stay on top of it and it'll be okay. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's pretty full on. It's pretty full on. I really need to book a massage. Um, I love that zone. Yeah, I didn't mind it at all. I thought it was absolutely gorgeous, firstly, but I can, I can understand why people didn't like it. I could see their complaints. I just didn't necessarily agree with all of them. Buying a Dartmoon present. Uh, buying a Dartmoon ticket bag from AH is also a thing you can do with your alts. Could be expensive, but it speed up things for you. From the black market auction house. Yeah. There's a, yeah. 
the guide here says the black market auction house um, in the grand by the ring of blood dark moon fanny pack contains hundreds of tickets although to be honest I'd probably want to speed that up on fear because she's the one I want to buy the 1,000 ticket mount on, you know. Once that once that's done, I'll be buying like four or five pieces of transmog every single month. Like that'll it'll start speeding up quite a bit. Then it's just getting the dirigible out the way is like ugh. It has to be more than eight diamond fifty because maybe I was not paying attention. Three forty-seven of three two two seven over seven tunes on one realm. Yep. So it's two hundred and seventy-eight tokens per monthly fare. You get one hundred and five tickets for completing both pet dailies for seven days. Um, but as you said, they're account wide. Not um, uh, that's an account wide daily, not per character. Uh, Eighty tickets for the dungeon and PvP box. So if you don't want to spend all the goddamn gold buying all that off the auction house, you don't get those eighty tickets. Uh, 42 tickets for completing six mini games for seven days. So, you know, 42 divided by seven is six tickets a day from just the dailies. 17 tickets for primary and secondary profession quests, which is what I'm doing, but that's a once off each month. It's not a daily. Uh, 10 tickets for turning in 250 grizzly trophies for test your strength. Problem with that is you actually have to go and do other content. So again, that's more time spent doing dungeons or, or world quests or whatever it happens to be. Uh, 10 tickets for completing Den Mother's Demise, uh, which starts from the, the Moon Fang Pelt, which is what we did before, which um, this is my most geared tune and I couldn't solo those wolves. So I'd have no hope doing that on alts unless it just happened to be up. I couldn't trigger it myself like I could on fear. Um, and then 14 tickets for completing the real race and the real big race for seven days. So that's two tickets per day. So the six from the prior plus those two is is eight tickets each day everything else is a once per month trigger and a lot of it you have to buy stuff or spend time farming stuff etc Yeah, sorry. No, no, no need to apologize at all. Um, yeah, I pulled open the Wowhead guide because, um, like, they're pretty good. Like, they're pretty good at laying out information really clearly. So I thought I'd jump on there and have a look. But yeah, eight tickets a day. <sighs> oh shit! Whoops, that's a game. Ha! Oops. <laughs> I'm very good. Oh, I'm not doing the archaeology. I have to go and get more fragments. Nope. Uh, live off of the wowhead yep yeah I try to stay off the front page and I definitely don't read their news articles because I don't want to give them clicks with their really really dodgy uh, practices um, but I absolutely use their guides and the items uh, like the comments on quests and all that kind of fun stuff But I mean, like, 8 times 50 is still 400 tickets a day. But the effort involved in in getting those 400 and, like, those 400 tickets, like... Oh. The one fear. Have anything ancient to trade? Needs to be at least two centuries old. Mm, monstrous egg. A treatise on strategy. Ornate weapon. Imbued crystal. If you find anything exotic, bring it to me. Great 
Oh, thank you. No one sends love letters anymore. Anything ancient to trade needs to be at least mm, not less. Not less. Better the full one. Captured insignia. Oh, my quest log is full, god damn it. Well For the Alliance. Be careful. Go with honor, friend. Life bless you. Be careful. What can I help you with? Go with honor. Um, how many do we have to do? This seems to take forever. Yeah, so it's gonna take uh, like a minimum of four months. Minimum. Of doing every single thing, every like all of them every single month, every day. Four months. I reckon I could probably do that though. Um, not this month, obviously. Uh, 148 at the moment. I've bought like a lot of the, like I've got all the other mounts and everything, so. Yeah, it's just um, a fun time. This one here take another month. No, because it's 278 per month. Um you've got a bit of leeway. So 1000 divided by 278. It's 3.6 months. So that last month, you only need to do just over half of the week. So it'll be like five out of the seven days, sort of thing. Um or actually it'd be less than that, because most of it's like one-off stuff. So it's not a matter of like missing one thing. You can afford to miss a few things here and there, um, but you just have to keep track of it. Spreadsheet. There's an emote for that. You get the hundred thousand fishing man. Yeah, I've got that one already. Definitely got that one. <laughs> Would you guys like a spreadsheet for tracking monthly DMF stuff that you can do? Is that something that would be useful to people? Be lovely actually because once I get these great sea herrings oh I've got it now um I've still got 15 minutes to wait before the next um heavy metal concert how the death metal happens I reckon I could whip something up Wait, most of fishing one gone. Whip it good. Alright, give me a minute. 
I'll jump into my Google Drive and we'll whip up a spreadsheet. And you guys can watch it happen in real time. How's that sound? All right, so we need to follow this path and we'll camp up here and then I'll pull open a, a spreadsheet. Okay, so DF starts on a Sunday, right? So you have a couple of hours after it opens. So you've got Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Fair start several hours before dailies reset on Sunday. Yeah, no, bugger it. I'm going to assume that you're not going to try to squeeze in those those couple of extra tickets. Uh, all right, where's my drive? Mm, 25, 35, change to GMF, just in the plus five, no refrof, man is fishing. Fishing kills so much time. It does. It does. <clears throat> Yama's Dark Moon Fair Tracking Sheet Okay I reckon I can do a count if that might work. Uh, all right. Blank sheet is blank. Pop it there. I want to pop it here. All right. So what is dark? What is where I had reckoned? So you've got 105 for completing both pet dailies seven days. So 105 divided by seven is 15. So you get 15 total from doing both pet battles. So you've got Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. I'm gonna uh, merge these. Pet battles. Uh, actually, both pet battles. Fifteen per day. Um, resize columns. Let's make it ten. Nope, too small. Resize columns thirty. Better. Uh, 80 tickets for dungeon and PvP books. Fifteen, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, five. Why does it say 80 if it's 85? 15, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. They've said this multiple times. You turn all nine books in, you earn 80 Dark Moon prize tickets and Dark Moon despoiler. But that adds up to. 85. This is the guide I'm looking at. Turns an hour. Now I was doing three days per I feel my life running away. Yep. Yep. 
Maybe one of these is wrong. I think the treaties on strategy number is wrong. It is. Okay, that's where they've gone wrong. So they've put the tre the treaties of strategy down as 15 tickets, but it actually gives you 10. Um, okay. So if I did... Fuck it, I'll just do the daily stuff, maybe. Oh, no, that... Uh, grumble, I'm trying to figure out how to make this work in a spreadsheet. I know what I'll do. Okay, so we'll go PvP books first. So we've got Fallen Adventures Journal. We've got... Banner of the Fallen, and we've got Captured Insignia. Um, resize to 40. That works. Um, then we've got dungeon items which are the imbued crystal the monstrous egg the mysterious grimoire the ornate weapon and the a treatise on strategy that's going to be dungeon items 10 uh, We're gonna make it centered and resize to 40. Then we have raid item. And that's the Soothsayer's Runes. Right, the pet battles. That one. Looks too cheesy to know. Looks correct. Yep. But yeah, it was um, it was saying you get eighty per month, eighty tickets per month for handing them all in. But their spreadsheet added up to eighty five. And then I realized it's because they have one of the dungeon items listed as providing 15 tickets, which it doesn't. It provides 10. Which gave me the five over that I was I was looking for, so that's good. Ah, she's making a spreadsheet again! Yeah, that's what I do. That's what I'm... You're here for it. I know you are. I know you are. Alright, so the bet the pet battles are once per account. So you can only do them on that tune. Uh, the items are on any one. 42 for completing six minigames for seven days. Minigames. So we've got hammer. We've got cannon. We've got uh, targets. We've got turtle. We've got tonk. And we've got firebird. Oh, and we've got the dancing one now too, so that's not on here. 
Did that give me one ticket or more? I know it's per day. That's all right. Can you see the, the, the like the letters of the week? Yep, that's why that's there. Um, chat, Miko, Zem, Ali, Rel, Neke, Martin, Apro, and Trig. Congratulations to all of you on your bonus shit. One word. Eight times on eight different tunes. Nope, they're per account, Chibi. It's once daily per account. So you can do it once every day, the seven days, or like eight if you want to count the little mini extra day right at the start, but it's only on one character. You can't do them on every character. They're account quests, account level quests, not character level quests. <clears throat> Here. Hello, Miko. Congratulations. Well done. Hockey day. Um, and we've also got dance now. Oh, shit. We've got the dance quest. So I'm, pr I'm going to assume that that's going to be one ticket like the rest of them are. Um... Center line. And there's, oh, right, shit, six mini games for seven days. So that's. All right. Oh, uh, this is gonna suck. Look at that. I'm not going to use that. Uh, we're going to clear that. Actually. stick that in. I can't. That's annoying. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Okay. That's totally fine spot. You don't need to apologize. Totally okay. Uh, all right. So we've got Dailies will do you six, seven tickets per day because we've got the dancing one now too. Okay. Copy these. Bonk them there. Better. Okay, I like that. Um, primary and secondary profession quests. So we have those are the three, yeah? Good. What are the So they give three and the pro- okay, cool. So we've got- oh, here we go.
One banshee, miss one bolt of light. I don't think there are enough people here to do a perfect performance. Can't take these hits. I'm gonna die. Two banshee waves. Pretty sure we're gonna need a bloody raid group to actually do this properly. Because these people aren't even trying to, like, do anything. There's like two of us here. Oh well. Well, they won't be playing for another hour, so... Oh dear. <laughs> I like the audio engineer. Um... I think that's all I can do... ...today. Except continue to build the spreadsheet. Um, uh, so these ones are four tickets per Dark Moon Fair. And then these ones are three per. Um, I 
And you've got the 250 Grizzly Trophies. That's once per thingamajig per. So you've got 10 per 4 trophies. And then 10 per 4 Moonfang. And then you've got the extra two tickets each day for the races, which are dailies. So I'm going to add that to here. So that makes nine per day from the dailies. Um, oh, thank you, Badger. Thanks for the look. Oh, thank you so much. There we go. The door. Ah, have fun. Best of luck getting there in time. Oh, it's really difficult to really buy anything. That's the point, though. you got to put in effort if you want rewards. Remember what we were saying before? It's exactly the same thing. Alright. So you've got... You've got your pet battles. you got your dailies. you got your PvP items. you got your dungeon items. you got your raid item. You've got your professions, you've got your secondary professions, you've got your trophies, and you got your moon fang. And then you've got a total for the month. Ah, look at the perfection on the size of that spreadsheet. Uh, Alright. Cool. So you can put your character names. Uh, that's not how you spell that. That is. Uh, you can put your character names down the sides. Uh, put your main or whichever character you're wanting to do the pet battle daily on at the very top because that's account wide, not per character. I really think that one week a month thing. Yeah, but it's still like. So yeah, if you've got Dark Moon set, you know that someone's put in a hell of a lot of effort. Okay, now... This is the tricky bit. So you count through here if it's an X. And then multiply that by 15. So if I've done it on Sunday, do I need to put extra brackets around this maybe? I've gotten the criterion wrong. Ooh. Yeah, there we go. Brilliant. So it's gonna so this the total at the end, if you so if you've done the pet battle for the day, both pet battles for the day, you put an X in the box. And it'll add 15 to your total. Right. Then brackets around that bit too because the more bracket it whoa what the hell plus count if the range is here and if it's an X We're going to count it. Then you're going to multiply it by nine plus count if this range, if it's an X, you're going to multiply it by five 
plus count if this range if it's an x we're gonna multiply it by 10 also count if this cell is an x then you multiply it by 15 plus count if this range, if it's an x, I'm gonna multiply it by 4 plus this range, if it's an x, you multiply it by 3 plus. I can actually merge these two. Count if this range, if they are x's, then you can multiply it by 10. Cool. So, no worries, Lucky. We'll see you next time. See you next time. So, if I've done one pet battle daily here, like both pet battles, but one day, I'll have 15 tickets. So I've done a set of dailies, it'll go up to 24. If I've turned in two dungeon items, it'll go up to 44. If I've done one of my professions, it'll go to 48. And let's say I did the trophies as well, that should get to 58. Hey, look at me go. All right, so that works perfectly. And now I just drag that all the way down. Perfect. So now it'll work for any character. So um, the spreadsheet, it's ugly. It's not very pretty, but it's now complete. So if you want a, if, oh, let me grab the share link again. Copy link. Bam. I know you can't see the formula. Um, that's why I was saying it aloud. Uh, so if you want to track dark moon stuff, um, basically the way that this works is uh, you put your characters down the left-hand side. There is enough space for you to put 52 names. So one account worth of characters, of course, you can extend the spreadsheet if you desire, if you've got more than one account or more than 50 characters. Um, but you can do that. Darkmoon Arcade Console. Oh. oh, this makes me happy. This makes me real happy. Um, so, <laughs> I did not know this existed and I am currently losing my mind. Um, how do I... Do, I can't mark them, can I? Oh, I can! Place a remove flag, look at that. Beautiful. So, spreadsheet. I've dropped the spreadsheet link. Um, uh, blue. Oh, the blue heart. Okay, give me a second. Um, yeah, so there's enough space for you to put 50 character names. The reason there's a big black bar at the start is because the pet battle quests are account wide. The daily, they are daily, but it's account wide. So you can only do it on one character each day. If you want to do it on different characters, the formula will still work. Um, oh, crap, I'm using the wrong... Can I, like... I just realised I was wearing the wrong headset. Well, it's not gonna work. I'm gonna refund you, because it's the wrong headset. I'm gonna pop that on my head, see how long I can balance it there. Um, but I'll give you the points back. Uh... <laughs> Not report, except, thank you. Different one, not that one. Uh, right, so, put your character names down the left-hand side. Um, when you have completed a task, for example, when you've done both pet battle dailies for the particular day, put a capital X in that cell. When you've turned in 
a a dark moon fair item put an x in that cell um when you've done all your dailies for that day you put an x in that day cell if you've done the grizzly trophies put a capital x in that you get the you get the picture and the number at the end the total column will show you uh how many tickets you've earned this dmf uh and then all you need to do is clear all the x's to reset it for next month If I've put a flag on it, will it, like, prevent it from blowing up if I stand on it? I don't trust it. Amazing. But yeah, the way to do that, so if you if you haven't used Google Sheets very much before, if you go up into File, under where it says Fiamma's Dark Moon Fair Tracking Sheet, if you click File, one of the options there says Make a Copy. What that will do is it'll copy my spreadsheet and put it into your drive, and it'll be called Copy of Fiamma's Dark Moon Fair Tracking Sheet, but you'll be able to edit it. So you'll be able to put your own characters in, you'll be able to stick the X's in the box, and you'll be able to see my beautiful formula that's miles and miles long. Nine three three per DMF. Um, is that a U? Is that just uh, you didn't put the X's in the uh, the black cells for pet battle dailies, eh? Let me pull it all the way down. Uh, I've got 9,105. If you have a look at, um, if you jump into mine now, you'll be able to see I've put X's everywhere and it says, and if I highlight the cell, the, the column, it calculates it as 9,105. <laughs> Where's the three come from? There you go. But yeah, that would take you a very long time. Level two, level two. Oh. There's a timer, okay. So one, thank God. Okay. Let's get you two. 
to there. Oh, what? <gasps> oh, bugger. All right. Calculated incorrectly. This is fun. I like this a lot. Did you guys know this existed? Like, there are so many little arcade game things. Boom. Yeah, I stood on mine. I exploded. I got it wrong. You didn't know either? Okay, good. So it's not just me. This is super cute. I've seen the Minesweep before. Yeah, no, how funky is it? Like, and there's like, there's no achievements. There's no, like, it's nothing like that. It's, um, it's just for funsies. So like, imagine the dev who was allowed to like, spend their time making this, like how much fun they would have had, like figuring out how to use WoW's, what's it? WoW's code to build Bloody Minesweeper. Usually I'm pretty good at Minesweeper. I feel really bad now that I stood on a mine. Oh, there's already one plumped in the corner. That's nice of them. Alright, can I look somewhere else? Yes. My first four. Wait, 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 wait. Don't, wait, don't try to make me sell that. <laughs> Cute. Anyway, players know what a minesweeper is? Yeah, look. I mean, a lot of us are a bit older, so that's fine, right? Level three? Ah! Level three! Oh, a three, okay. Okay. That's gonna be a one. That's gonna be a one, which means that these two are clear. There's your one. Three. That's a one. That's a one. That's one. There's a two, so that's going to be that one there. I didn't I miss that. So those two are thingy. That's a two. 
One, two, three. One, two, three. That'll be clear. Three, four. Which means that this one needs to be clear. Cool! Yay! Is there a four? <gasps> God, there is. Okay, whew! I'm gonna be here until three in the morning! <gasps> Congratulations, Spot! 2028. Well done! Good night, Ali. Good night. Rest well. We'll see you next time. This is, this, I, oh gosh, this is so much fun. Spreadsheets and Minesweeper in one night? I'm in heaven. I'm in heaven. Alrighty. V, Fade, Dunno, Bod, Ali, Litter, Ali again, Spam, and Ral. Different Ali. Two different Allies. Congratulations to all of you on your bonus shit. Thanks for stream. I finally understood the logic behind my sweeper. What? Did I accidentally taught you how to play Minesweeper? That's got to be a clip, right? <laughs> yeah, it, the number tells you how many mines are hidden in its immediate vicinity. <laughs> yeah, how cool is that? Yeah, it's, well, it's, you know, there's got to be some kind of logic to the game, otherwise it wouldn't be playable, right? <laughs> The myself for watching you play. Okay, good. Okay, all right. Oh my god, that's hilarious. Oh, excuse me. All right. Let's go uh, send some love. How did you play Minesweeper before tonight's stream? Randomly clicking, probably. That's how lots of people play Minesweeper. They just randomly click. Um. Yeah, it's it's a whole time. This button, please. We're gonna start a raid. We are going to send some love over to Galaxy Oz Twitch raid. Here we go. Grab your copy paste if you don't have the Fiamma Hype emote, either because you're not a sub or because you have not unlocked it using your embers. Which is, either of which are totally fine. Uh, you can still copy and paste the whole message, delete the Fiamma hype and replace it with your favorite happy, hypey, celebratory emote and then drop it in Galaxy's chat when we get there. Um, Galaxy's lovely. She's a friend of mine and I'm very, very excited to see her in October for PAX. Like, so goddamn excited. You have no absolute idea. Friday, secret finding. Make sure you get here as soon as you can like early in the stream because I'm going to put up polls so that you guys can choose which secrets I'm going to try to hunt down. Sunday is transmog hunting and that will also be the day that the TikTok Tale for Two challenge, the stream challenge closes. So make sure to get your embers in when you can. Mount Farm Monday, Mage Tower next Wednesday. I'm going to die lots and it will be very entertaining. Ah. Uh, 
we're good. Take care of yourselves. Be nice to each other. I hope you've had a wonderful evening. I truly have. So thank you for being here. And I'm going to see you on Friday. All the love. Mwah. Bye, guys. Boogie down.